Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the host of The Krigler Show, Adam Krigler. That was, I don't know, I, I'm not sure what, what that was. Yeah. What's up, guys? How you doing? Welcome to the show. It's Monday. Did you guys have a good Monday? I'll tell you what. I had a freaking great day. You know why? Because the sun was shining. And I was out in the sun all day, just feeling that heat on my skin. It was great. It was fantastic. I I got rid of the beard. I don't know if you noticed. I got rid of the beard. All right, look. I felt the spring on my face, and I was like, all right, it's time. It's time to get rid of it. Uh, hold on. Let me bring uh, Let me bring the boys in here. Gentlemen, wait, I can't hear him. I, I didn't mute you. No, I was muted at first. Oh, you're muted. Okay. Yeah. I, I did mute you because we were live before 630, so I didn't want anyone. Yeah, no, uh, it was good because I just went in there and slapped Mo, so you definitely helped me out of a domestic case. <laughs> <laughs> uh, why? Oh, I have to hit auto. I like the beard. I like you without the beard. Call! <laughs> What's my up, man boys? my guy we missed you and you, you, you look healthy you're glowing look at this guy oh, Am I? You I like my shirt? You, yeah yeah and you got a good do and the beanie too i like the beanie a lot i don't know about I like the, the shirt's power. actually I like the vest pretty i know i thought flop would appreciate the drip yes today. i should have i got it i got a one-of-a-kind shirt on actually i don't nice. know nice 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 and got the little, little zorbu i like it we got like a double I didn't know yeah, that. we got Zorbu all over the place. Um, what else? I Zorbu oh, just right before this. I did have there it is. I I did have the uh, base staff beanie yeah, on over there. earlier. It's too hot mm -hmm. out here. But, I, but but I was like, you know what? It's nice in here. I'm yeah. I'm gonna ride. And I I got a new haircut. I got a fade. I like it. I like the haircut. I like the beard cut. Yeah, you know, guys, it was so nice today. I just I'm like I'm just gonna. I'm, well, I I cut it a couple days ago, uh, but it was great this weekend. I spent the weekend, guys finishing uh, it's almost finished um my new studio to make rings to make nice. knives to work uh metal smithing woods well carpentry i was gonna say wood smithing but that would be carpentry uh but anyway i'm really <laughs> looking forward to it uh, i have a picture actually let me let me pull a picture up and show you guys i don't know if i did you post it on locals actually yeah i might have posted i think like i remember I've, seeing the picture i've been posting random stuff on locals i'm trying to like post some more stuff over there it is on local I, I post it on local so if you it look nice if you're over on my locals you would have seen this already because i try to post post things there you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. all right so here is boom nice, nice. So here, here's Ooh, nice. here's my new studio now if you look on the left side this is my new belt grinder that i love um Currently, there's no lights in the room. I have a big like floodlight. There's a light. I'm about to say it looks bright as fuck in there. Mm. Yeah, because I, I, you can see on the left side, I have like a extension cord. I, I have that coming from the entire other side of the house right now. So, yeah. uh, but this is my new studio. I, I have it. It, it's basically in like my barn. I call it. We call it the longhouse because it's more. It's more. It looks more like a Viking longhouse than a barn. It's not really a barn, but anyway, I, I'll do like a whole nice. walkthrough. I've made a a full video. By the way, of you already me. have. Well, I'm. It's almost done, but the video I, I've filmed everything. My mom was here, and she helped me basically take everything out and clean it. Uh, it. It looks like a completely different place. And the electrician was supposed to come today, couldn't make it, but he's probably going to be here tomorrow or Wednesday. Um, I've already actually installed lights. He just. I. I don't want to fuck anything up, so I'm mm -hmm. having an electrician come and actually do all the wiring and put a fuse in the fuse box and like connect it all I, yeah i wouldn't yes. do that shit <laughs> yeah right right that, so, yeah. like yeah. insurance won't cover it if you do yeah. it yourself and uh, like i i don't want not, not that i'm worried about it but electrician stuff is like I'm I, I i i never like my dad was a heating and air conditioning guy so like i know all about heating and air conditioning i don't know about um airspace stuff that was more what my dad did i i was the installation dude um but like carpentry making stuff out of wood and that the base level trades i'm good but electric electricity i don't want to fuck with. i don't want to burn I anything down i would so, like the whole right. freaking garage you know what basically. i mean yeah 
Yeah, yeah. I don't, I I don't want to risk it. So I, I'm pretty it. excited though. Um, so I wanted to let everyone filter in a little bit. I got some big news. Um, okay. That that I wanted to. I don't want anyways. Uh, Garrett's not gonna make it today. Um, Love you, Garrett. And, and he he is editing a video, and he was at a bachelor party all weekend, so he's probably a little hungover. Oh shit! Yeah, Garrett gets or, crazy. Or may, maybe sore in the the I don't know how <laughs> in the rear end. What, what, what kind of stuff he gets gets into? Could have been uh, supposedly Zorbu was at the uh, the bachelor party, so we're not sure. Wow. Damn, he was probing, probing. probing yeah. yeah. Wow. <laughs> I mean, you know, or double probing because you know oh, bachelor yeah. parties. Yeah, you know crazy. they. There was sounds like crazy. he had a terrible weekend. <laughs> I've been. Have you ever been to a bachelor party, guys? I, I nah, don't nah, we don't get yeah. married in the black Dude, black community. <laughs> I've been to some crazy ones, honestly. Uh, okay, multiples. Okay, you've been to multiples. Yeah, I've never okay. been to a bachelor party. Let me, all right, so call. Let me ask you: Have you yeah. ever seen a double dildo at a bachelor at a bachelor at party? Your, at the bachelor parties, absolutely never. Oh, I thought Never. you were gonna say yeah, bro. No. I thought yeah it was coming. <laughs> I've been to one Only bachelor one. party <laughs> in my life. In my life, one bachelor party, and uh, yeah, I saw that. What the? F- Why? Was someone using it? Yes. Okay. Okay. Not guys. It was no. Okay. No, it was okay. two yeah, two ladies. Um, okay. It was at a strip cool. club too. It was oh, like yeah. Oh, yeah. Someone who worked for my dad at the time, he owned his own business, heating air conditioning. One of the one of his employees was getting married, and mm-hmm. I just was like, "Hey, you want to go to the bachelor party?" I wasn't even invited to the wedding, but it was just like <laughs> the three other guys that worked for my dad. They were all in the wedding, and like, they, but they were like, "Hey, Adam, you want to like we're doing the you bachelor party? You want to go?" Because yeah, yeah. we're like, <laughs> you, you know, we're it? working. <laughs> it's it's like freaking cold as shit in in winter time in Chicago, so whatever i was kind of you know we were i was one of the guys and they were like yeah come to the bachelor party i'm like okay awesome. and uh yeah you know, <laughs> that's what you saw you, you can't unsee that it's uh <laughs> it, it happened um that sounds crazy honestly i never saw that <laughs> but i've seen some crazy shit in bachelor parties yeah it was it, it was wild it i'm was not wild. that's not appealing to me mm. it, it wasn't shit. actually appealing yeah. the the strip club was Actually, I don't know if I've been to been Dude. to a strip club other than that. I it went was, to so many strip clubs it, in that. It was like <laughs> I've it's never crazy. even been to a strip club before. What, how do I describe sadness? Mm. Uh, honestly, mm. it was like it felt of sad. <laughs> it reeked of sadness. It didn't yeah. smell like sadness, but it reeked of sadness. You know, it's like crazy. Yeah, guys dude. were sad, the girls yeah. were sad, yeah. everyone was sad. That makes sad. sense. That makes sense. That's, it depends on the strip club. It, just, it yeah. depends on the strip club, honestly. But um, because then you know, have you been to a classy sadness. one? Have you been to a classy yeah. one? I have been to oh, some, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, they disguise um, the sadness. <laughs> I mean, some of them aren't That's that sad, honestly. One? I mean, but like the girls are. You, you don't want to go to a a, a, a CD like shitty one because that's really depressing like that's where you can was stick things in and not get in trouble bro that's, that's where i was at i think i was yeah. at one of those the first i mean one double I dildo that's you, you don't have that in a classy one <laughs> no <laughs> fucking best. yeah no i mean this was this was oh man 15 years ago yeah so i think times have changed i don't think they'd, they'd be allowed anymore even i want to hear about this dirty one Sad. Well, was, uh, okay. Uh, was like, well, yeah. Explain. Describe the well, classic one. First of all, first of all, the first trip club I ever went to was depressing. Mm-hmm. Like, and it was okay. 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 like Adam Sad. talked about. Yeah. yeah. And <laughs> like the strippers were okay. Like I was like, okay. Like, I could yeah. go for some McDonald's. Hey. You know what I mean? But <laughs> <laughs> anyway, anyway. But I was like really young at the time. So like it was my first time ever being in a strip club. So I was like obviously like like nervous. Like I'd never been in there. I didn't know what it was like. I didn't know like the culture of what you're supposed to do. So I was a bit of a wallflower, like my arms folded and the stripper was like, she got so she threatened to like pour her drink all over me. I didn't say shit. Like I was just standing there. And then uh I got like forcefully motorboated by some one of the other strippers. Yeah. yeah. I was like, <laughs> all right, that happened. But the classic <laughs> ones, dude, when the, I won't say which bachelor party or, you know. Wait, what. wait, wait. Did that motorboat also smell like sadness? <laughs> no, <laughs> had no, no, no. It was a When you were motorboat. in there, was it was okay. it just sadness? No, 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 no. It was good. No, no, no. It was nice. Was like, oh, oh, good. All right, nice. Soft and nice. Okay. Enjoyable. <laughs> yeah, oh, they, so they were real. So one enjoyable part. 
Yeah. Oh, good. That was nice. the stripper that threatened to pour her drink on me because I wasn't like giving her attention. I wasn't like like doing anything I guess you're supposed to do at the strip club. Again, this is my first time at a strip club. So I was like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Pay just, me. Yeah, I was a little like anxious and uncomfortable. I'm like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. And she took that as like, this guy's a fucking prick. And I was like, lady. That's what a prick. He's just trying to look at me for free. It's like, yeah. she has issues. It's a strip club. Club. What? <laughs> yeah. I, what are you expecting? I'm there's broke, a ton. Man. There's a ton in Oregon. Um, and I went to like some nice ones and we went to like the dude, it was depraved because like one of my buddy's friends wanted to like go to every type of strip club. Like, this is your baseline worst one. Like he wanted to go there and I didn't want to go there. Compare you contrast. Made use of he wanted to compare yeah. and contrast, but let me tell you, comparing and contrasting when you're starting at the the not great ones. Like, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oof. Like, I'm bad. not looking forward to this anymore. I thought no. I was, but then we went no. to one. Now I'm was like, there any that was like wonderful, dude. There was one that was much better, where all the girls were like obviously very attractive, and okay. like you know, there was a nice club. They like, filter, they regulate the the girls. Oh yeah, like there's a okay. standard, and the standard okay. was being met. Gentlemen. Okay, and, nice, <laughs> nice. Okay. I gotta go to a strip club. Well at some met point. standard. <laughs> yeah, it was good. Oh, you've never, never been, been to a strip club? Never in my life, and I probably won't because uh, yeah. I punch a bitch. But yeah. Yeah, yeah well, it's I definitely won't, don't I recommend don't. going if you're going to do that. Yeah, no, I'm not yeah, going to you, but I have I to. I went to one. I want to keep my. I don't think I'll go again. It's really? not. Yeah. No. The I sadness, I, I know what you're talking about, and it's especially yeah. with the patrons, especially like the first one I went to, there was like yeah. this there was like this 70-year-old guy and he was not depressed. Like he was excited. <laughs> he was like this is a great day. He's my He's like my wife just died. I got so, I just yeah. got paid. He was having a great time. I'm free again. But everyone life, watching life it was like, there. this is depressing. Like, this is fucked up. He's I like, was, I just I got my, my Viagra prescription. I'm oh, ready to go. Dude, and then there was a, the, uh, one of the nicer ones. <laughs> bro, one of the nicer ones, there was like an old couple. Well, and hey, they were like, more power to them. They were like really enjoying. What do you like, mean old? Define like, old. Like they were in their 60s. And they yeah, were like okay. a loving couple. That's, but that's they were like, there. yeah, shake those titties. And it that's was weird. There. It was weird. I mean, I, like, I think it's it was more like they were acceptable going to the movies, but like for for a girl to be by than a guy to be by. Don't this don't was like think? a grandma grandpa though. Like no, they look like yeah, sweet. But like older people. you know, who doesn't like titties, right? I mean, there are they're everyone's first food source. So. I think it makes more sense for old people to be there. Like mm -hmm. I don't judge old people for being at a strip club. It's the young people that I'm. They're just more. living their life. They're yeah, like, they're fuck just it. like, hey, we're doing what we're doing, man. You know what I mean? want we today? Fuck it. <laughs> yeah, I want to see some titties. I'm like working for it. <laughs> the youngins, go find a girl. Mm -hmm. Let me no, let yeah. me see what these 2020 titties look like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or you'll see the guys. There's, there'll be like guys man. that are like normal aged that like think like the strippers are into them. Like them. Yep. They don't get the yeah. like, yo, you're this is a racket and you are yep. the product, bro. Yeah, like, she doesn't yeah. like you, dog. This is, like, this is sad. That's sad. This but that's true. what they're selling now. So it's like, hey, mm -hmm. they're selling. No, no, I'm like you. Give me money. Give, yeah. give me yeah. money. And then yeah. I saw, yeah, I saw what else? There was some crazy shit. Well, <laughs> we don't have to keep going on the strip club yeah. stuff. That's uh, no, nah, this is a strip club podcast now. Let's random, do it. random Woo! sidebar. I, I have the ability to permanently mute you. Um, Strippers. and by the way. A uh, super chat. All you have to do is super chat me to mute flawed at any time. Here That's we go. Part of the show. Ship. Uh, <laughs> just to let you know. Any amount. I don't even care. Just any any, any amount. amount. That's crazy. <laughs> Literally any amount. <laughs> yep. Uh, now there's a, a scale, right? It's a, it's, a, yep. it's a sliding scale, though. So the more you 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 the give, more you the, pay, the, the more silence. You want mm -hmm. him removed? Super chat. That's hundred dollars. A hundred dollars. Okay. Hundred dollars, I will kick him off the show. Yep, I'll be out of here. A hundred dollars right now. To me, to me though, not not him. Yeah, you're acting no, like you get the me. money. No, oh, okay, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm balling. I don't get money. You know what I mean, <laughs> damn. All right, no, I'm not balling. I'm not balling. No, but Claude's, you are. Claude's camera is balling. Yeah, it's true. No, but what you camera are... do you have again? Huh? All right. What camera do you have again? S for a Lumix S5. Lumix S5. Yeah, and did then you, I have. Didn't a... we do this last week? Yeah, we I also did. have a crazy we lens, did. too. The lens is crazy as the camera. Yeah, yeah really? the lens, the lens yeah. makes the camera, really. Yeah. That's true. So the, the lens, lens is, is more expensive part. than the camera? No, nah, it's similar price. Sometimes. To the camera. Yeah, there's, yeah, right? you yeah. yeah, you definitely can. If I got a more expensive lens, it would make the camera even better. Yeah, because the, the camera's capable, but the lens is definitely the change mm, yeah, maker. Yeah, the key. Yeah. You've been uh, absolutely destroying it lately 
uh, fly yeah. on yeah, on the crazy. internet, man. Your your rap your diss was broken down. Uh, what was his name? Crip. Crip. Uh, yeah. The Crip. Fucking, that was yeah. that was a cool breakdown. I I watched you watching it, so I, yeah. I didn't watch his video, but I I like watching you break things down because I like your analytical brain. Um, you. like like you you did uh, that Adam Calhoun. Yep, uh, recently yeah, recently just did that, that today. That was also a diss for Upchurch, right? So he said it wasn't. Or, I think he was dissing. I think he was like like okay. touching on things, like jabbing, like it could be a diss if you want to take it there. Okay. But then he was dissing like reactors and shit too. He dissed you what? a little bit too. No, no, he didn't diss me. I talked to him. He definitely didn't diss me. Uh yeah, you did. Mm-hmm. Because you thought it was an eight, you thought it was an eight. Oh, the M and M one. <laughs> yeah, uh, no, he, he did. did. You, he you did it. You did. did. You were like, shit. Oh, he got me. Yeah, right. I was one of those. But he don't did. worry, I was one of those too. But I mean, I'm <laughs> I'm a noob when it comes to hip hop. I me too. Send, like, right. send me. Noob. Are you? Yeah, I know how I to mean, rap, but like, I started listening you're... to rap at Fifty Cent. Mm. Wow. Okay. So I was yeah. listening to rap before you were. Wow. Yeah. I'm not a big rap guy. I wasn't. That's. Uh, shocking actually to me that is actually yeah. very shocking yeah. <laughs> i'm more og <laughs> than got, you yeah you got that on me bro i listen uh, to i mean you're you're pregnant. also a young man so you know it's fine i was listening to lesbian music me, me and call <laughs> we're we're pushing 40 over here <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah we're dead bro oh yeah so you got a few years <laughs> on me yeah there you go we're, fucking dead, bro. <laughs> we're old men my back's hurting shit my yeah. back hurts every day dude does fit? it really you ever have yeah. those chirp wheels those chirp wheels are incredible Chirp the what? Wheel. There's a chirp wheel. There's like a big one, a small one, and you roll your back. I have, right here. I have oh, a whole bunch see. of them. Is that, right that, those, that? is that yeah, what that is? They're incredible. You know what I? Oh, I'm gonna wait for him to come back, dude. Anytime you do it, your back will crack like crazy. It feels incredible. Yep. There they are. Oh, hold on. Can I make him the solo? Yeah. Oh, look at that. There they are, dude. Oh, oh those are okay. the shit, aren't they? Oh, <laughs> yeah, so you just I got them my back hurt. Roll, roll your back on those. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yep, man. Oh, Nisha would love those. Yep. They were like one hundred fifty-five dollars. It's worth on Amazon it. for all of them. They was worth it. It is nice, nice. Yeah, it's okay. like your own personal chiropractor, bro. Yeah, I've Legit. been. You know what I've been doing? I've been mountain biking every day. I got a mountain bike, and I, I, I talked about it. Bikes. But like, it, it snowed basically the whole time my mom was here. It snowed like three days before she got here, and then it, it snow stayed, and then she left, and it went away, and now it's dry again. Mm. Um, which was great because she wanted it to be snowy here because it wasn't last time she was here, but. Uh, hi, mom. By the way, I miss you. I love you. Um, What's up, Mama Craigs? I, I saw her in chat, so I know she's. I here. saw her too for a second. And I've been rocking my mountain bike everywhere, dude. And my legs are sore. My back sore. Good. My like arms a good are sore. sore. Right? Yeah, great sore. Yeah. Like I'm. I haven't worked these muscles. I, I was a skater. I was a rollerblader. And I. I. My first mode of transportation in life was my own bike. I most kids. I feel like you yeah, get a bike, mine right? Yeah, and then. And then I didn't get another bike for like 30 years. Yeah. I just, so like now I have a bike again. I'm like, I love it. Like, yeah. and I am surrounded by trails, guys. It is insane. I, I haven't gone to the same trail. trail twice. I, mm. I have just like, I get lost in my forest and I'm like passing different paths. And I'm like, I'll do that next time. I'm just going to keep going. And I'll, oh, there's another one. I'll do that next time. And it, it's amazing. I love it. And that's my workout. And I'm, I'm really hyped. And nice. I'll be honest. I feel out of shape and I don't mm. like it. Yep. I, I don't, I don't like it guys. I, I was a pro skater where I was skating like 20 miles a day. Like that was my vehicle. I would skate into the city, which is like a seven mile skate from, from where seven I lived. In dude, I, I've seen your videos where you're hanging on cars and shit in New York. Yeah. Oh yeah. That shit's crazy. Oh, I was nuts, crazy. Dude. Yeah. So now, or now I like ones. now I sit and I drive everywhere. I'm like, I don't feel that I have that activity anymore. So, I've been working out and I've been rocking this mountain bike and I'll tell you the reason why. All right. You want to know go. why? I want to know why. Because you're black. You got... You're transitioning. <laughs> I knew it. Let's do it. It's 2024. <laughs> so actually it's. I fucking acceptable. knew it. <laughs> I mean, anything can happen. No, the reason why is because I really want to be fit um, for when my kids get older, you know, and mm. um, we all should. I, and to be alive I, longer just right. I, i've been hiding this for a long time and it's been fucking eating me up chat uh just give me a second boys um i have something to show you all and this is the uh biggest thing to ever happen to me um this is my this is my child 
and uh, this is happening. I'm pregnant. Well, my wife is. <laughs> no, you're pregnant. You're pregnant. You're right. Well, I mean, I am. I am. And uh, I'm like getting teary eyed just thinking about the fact that I'm going to be a dad. And yeah, so he's already a model. It's, uh, it's happening. And and there, I don't know if it's a boy or a girl yet. It mm -hmm. uh, doesn't matter. You can see it's it's little hand. It's uh, it's it's waving. Whoa. It's waving hi to you. And uh, hey, I've been kids. I've been hiding it for a long time. It's been tough. I I you know you're not supposed to say anything for a while. And um, we she I I was like I wanted to tell the world immediately. <laughs> I just wanted to scream it from the mountaintops. Um, but Nisha was like, no, we shouldn't do it. And I I was like, all right, you know, you're right, you're right. And uh, she said yesterday, like you could tell the world now and i was like yes <laughs> finally like ah oh, i'm so excited that i can like actually talk about this and it's like part of the reason why i i'm starting this new channel i, I miss creating i want to be a creator and i don't feel like i'm a creator like i'm a youtuber but that i don't create like i used to i used to write a lot of songs i used to skate and make skate videos and create tricks i i designed a board i designed skate wheels that never actually went in there it was kind of sad i was going to call them the crispy creams uh my nickname was crispy krigler that's anyway different yeah different that's, time. Good. that's good you can say it it's pretty good crispy Wait, you were going to name the wheels crispy creams oh. and they were going to be donuts can you do that well, yeah i mean oh, well no. i would i would spell it i would spell it differently oh. because trademark you know, yeah yeah right. probably yeah. probably couldn't do it but but the wheels um, would be donuts yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. They, they, they nice. would be that little, little donut, donut wheels, right? You know what I mean? Yeah, Dude, so. kind of dope. Uh, but I'm back. I'm going to be creating. I, I have been around kids my entire life. I have 50 something cousins. You worked with one. <laughs> and <laughs> uh, I, I know they emulate you, they want to be around you. And I can't wait to raise yep. a child. And I want to show them how to create and not just talk about what other people are creating i think that's mm -hmm. really important yep so that's that's my my change i i haven't played video games in a long time I, I don't feel the desire anymore something like changed in my brain when um when nisha said that she was pregnant you know because we had been trying for a little while and uh when she told me i just kind of i don't know something something changed in in there and i don't know how to describe it i mean your father, right? I mean, you were yep. young though, right? Yeah, so. I was super young, but uh, you know, it's it still happens. If I could have, it would have it would have been like that, you know. But I went to jail instead. But yeah, that's yeah, changed yeah. In my life. Yeah, I mean, both pretty big things have happened. You had them both happen to you. That's crazy. Yeah. So, but he's he's huge now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's, he's bigger he's than like me. 14? He's literally bigger than me. He's fourteen. He's bigger than me. Yeah, wow. literally taller than me. Yeah. I was like, that was a total guess, and I nailed it. No, he um, is. He, yeah, he's fourteen. He's huge. No, I know. I didn't yeah. know. I just guessed. Actually, because of what he, he looked. He's like. gonna be fifteen in June. Damn, he's, that's crazy. Okay, so he's but he's yeah. fourteen. Yeah. Oh. Nice. Yeah, he's crazy. like almost a yeah, grown ass crazy. adult. Yeah. My well, I have a daughter too. She's literally about to be eighteen in August. Holy shit! But you have a daughter crazy. too. Yeah, three daughters. I have four kids. Whoa! You have crazy. four kids. I have four kids. I have three daughters and a son. My daughters are all I with did. one chick that I'm not even allowed to talk to because there's an indefinite restraining order. What? And, uh, yeah, but my daughter's about to come up here. Is so. it because of, you know, yeah. like, yeah. back in the day kind yeah. of stuff? Bullshit, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Metastep, Meta thank you so much, man. Metastep just direct deposited me uh, 50 bucks. Ooh. That's not enough. Thank That's huge. Thank you so That's much. That's not enough. Babies said, are a million put, dollars each. Put Put this towards something for the baby thank you very much meta i appreciate you to me that's that's huge dude what uh, uh what house do you think your kid's gonna pick when he goes to hogwarts or she <laughs> and what house I, are I, you gonna pick i you haven't I, been I, to hogwarts I, either I, I don't even i don't even understand that i yeah. i don't understand what you're saying right now well, he will, i'll tell you what i will, will read it i'll yeah. well Do yeah and i'll know harry potter no, he doesn't. I've never read it. Never seen yeah. it. Yes, finally something that we both don't fucking know. Nice. It's true. True. Finally, hey. bro. Yeah. Finally, man. Damn. There it is. You feel you feel good about that? Yeah, I'm vindicated a little bit. <laughs> I mean, I, I guess it's something you haven't I, seen. It's huge, and you haven't seen it. But but I That's purposefully true. haven't watched it. 
I know. I remember you saying that, but I take that part yeah, out, of the, out of the equation. Okay. You're like, you're like, I don't give a yeah, shit. Forget that part. That. You haven't seen it. Doesn't, doesn't matter. <laughs> Nerd alert. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I, I keep this. It's framed at my on my desk. I know you already got it <laughs> framed and shit. <laughs> it's the, a frame already. This is the that. first picture of my child. It's the sure. first picture sure. of, of my kid. Like she's doing blue I, steel. I think. <laughs> it kind of it kind of is <laughs> look look he's doing blue steel oh he's gonna be a stunner i don't know i think it might be a, i thought it was gonna be a girl at first yep. like i had this feeling I'm like oh i think it's gonna be a girl and then i've been around a lot of pregnant women in my life my two two i have three sisters two of them have eight kids between the two of them a lot of so i have and a lot many? of nieces and ne- eight kids to my yeah. sisters. Right. So I've been around a lot of just my sisters have been pregnant a lot in my life. Eight kids. Mm. Uh, and not to mention my cousins. Um, and I have a little clan over there. My great my dad's mother has a hundred human beings underneath her. Damn. Spiraled out from her just eight like sons. Matriarch, matriarch. Three you daughters. Your dad's mother? My dad's mother. Yeah. So your grandmother. Gr- Grandma Krigler has a hundred humans. So I Man. have, I've been around babies a lot in my life. And one thing that I, I don't know if this is true, but one thing that I've noticed is when it's a boy, women tend to look exactly the same. They don't like gain weight everywhere, just in their belly. Like the belly just is like, boom, yeah. just the belly. But when it's a girl, they tend to get Still chubby out. everywhere. Yeah. They like get, chunky all over the place yeah, and yeah. you like they get like the baby weight and i think it like maybe it's a multiple hormones like dual competing women's hormones versus like a guy who's just like i'm i'm getting ready to be in the world you know um mm. i don't know if that's true but totally I mean, just think, my own I don't version think it's true for my situation but I, I think i could see it you know there's exceptions to every rule so my situation may have been different but yeah right but well i mean your Krigler seed might be different than the Marcus seed. You know what I mean? So I mean, well, I had two babies mothers. One of them got huge. One of them didn't get big at all. Mm. But the, both the ones daughters? with the girls thought, didn't I, get big. Oh, it's the opposite. But the one with the boy, yeah, blew up. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, maybe that's maybe that's the black. Yeah, that's the black. Yeah. Thing. <laughs> that's what I was about to say. I think it's the black. <laughs> <laughs> maybe that, maybe that's maybe that's the the yeah. black. Um, yeah, I think it's the black. <laughs> yeah, and so. But based on that, she has only just the her belly is just getting bigger now. You think it's a girl? No, I, I mean, think it's a guy. I, mean, I, I think it's a boy now. I think it's a boy mm-hmm. now. I, I I don't know yet. So do you uh, have a find out or are you like in a whatever. couple weeks? I don't. No preference. Know. I I if I were, I would like two kids. Yeah. And I, I would love a boy and a girl. That's what everybody you know? says. You're gonna have ten. Yeah. I'm gonna have ten. Yeah, just because you Next said that. Gonna Next one's gonna be a boy. Yeah. Next one's gonna be a boy. Yeah. My family, Everyone's my like, family could have done that, and it's like, lunch. except they wanted a girl, and it was boy, 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 boy. <laughs> oh yeah, wow, really? Exactly. Yeah. Well, look, look at this. They, they got a girl. My dad had a girl, then a boy. All right. My older sister, then me. Th- then my sister had a girl, then a boy. My other sister had a boy, then a girl, and it's like my sister or my wife's parents had a boy then a girl um my wife's uh aunt and uncle she only has one aunt and uncle uh, uh well that she's like close to boy and a girl so, so it's like boys and girls every in everyone everyone what around age? me every yeah well i mean they some had continued to have more babies but like the first two kids were a boy and then a girl or, or a girl, girl and then boy. a boy right mm. it didn't matter but it was like yep. alternated i yep. i know it's totally like a Hey, it's actually not 50 50, right? It's like a 52 I don't 48. Know. I, I don't know. There's some, there's more women than something. men. Yeah, yeah, in the world. It, I think it's 52% chance to be a girl or something like that. I, yeah. I, I could be completely wrong. I, I don't maybe actually. 51. I don't know. Who knows? Do you know, chat? Is that true? I mean, did I just pull that out of my asshole? I, I, I might have, but I feel like I heard that somewhere. I don't know. Hmm. But anyway, uh, that is my major announcement. So I, I'm nice. glad to get get that off my chest. Dude, that's um, huge. Congrats, man. That's awesome. I, nice. Yeah, I I was pretty mad at Andreas for yeah. saying it a couple weeks ago. Um, 
he yeah, hasn't been on. I, I didn't like tell him not to come on. I just he, he was live I, yesterday. He felt really bad about it. He's apologized to me a hundred times. Um, Damn. But I, it was at the very end of the show. I said goodbye and hit the that was like, crazy. <laughs> yeah, that shit was crazy. Theme. It was and, just me, you, and Andreas. That shit was. And wild. he just dipped. Yeah, I was. I was so annoyed. But um, yeah. But now yeah. the cat's out of the bag. I don't have to Facts. freaking hide it. I I could talk about the fact that I'm to be a dad. I'm. Re- oh, it's fifty one percent for a boy. A boy King deplorable huh? said. What? Oh, really? Interesting. I not what I expected, but okay. Me either. Sure. Now you get to make dad right. jokes and shit. Yep. I do. Yep. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I already do. It's don't I? You do. You definitely. But now do. it's like official, and it's like you have the clearance. Maybe you started yeah. right when you got her pregnant. It was just like I morphed. That's it's what like, the change you felt. It's like I want to get new balances. What is that all about? <laughs> now you like you have an urge to just check the Cargo thermostat short all the time. Does someone <laughs> touch the thermostat. Hey, I feel like someone's touched it. You turned it on. <laughs> it cost me extra money, boy. <laughs> it's like why she's she's over there. Like why are you talking to the cat? I'm like someone touched the thermostat. <laughs> Cats Meta said there you. was signs. What were the signs? What were the signs? Was there signs? I didn't see any signs. Maybe because I knew, but I don't know. I mean, there was a definite change. I, and also, um, I stopped doing my daily show Everything. when I, <laughs> well, when I, you know, it's, it's when I found out because I wanted, to, or a little bit before because I wanted to, um, we were trying and i was yeah. like ah, i'm not i'm not Need gonna that extra I'm time like, baby <laughs> well she would she goes to sleep and you know i was like i just like all right i just i just go like this mo wake up wake up it's time <laughs> <laughs> what do you get watch come on <laughs> just, just shit. wake up <laughs> sounds like a horrible way to wake up <laughs> jesus <laughs> Time to make a baby. <laughs> Every day is D Day when she wakes him up. He wakes her up. <laughs> the alarms. Wow. I turn on the sirens yeah. and everything. Oh, oh man. <sighs> so well, I, it, she's dude. Holy shit! Does the Swedish system? <laughs> she she gets like an insane amount of time off. That's awesome. From being pregnant, like, like maternity. Yeah, leave? it's it's like wild actually. Like how much time she gets. Um, give and then you a like, decade to do what you need to do. <laughs> <laughs> You're good. Well, that's that's Germ- That's like Austrian there, but that's, uh, true. Cool. that's my neighbor. I mean, I I don't know how their system is, but man, is she looking forward to uh, being off? But the time is going to be actually work really well because I'm up at night, so I can kind of assist when the baby wakes up, and I can allow her to sleep, and then you mm-hmm. know because we have we kind of do sleep together. When I'm on my normal schedule and I'm doing my daily show, uh, but like usually I'll go, she's already sleeping and then she'll wake up and I still sleep. But I don't know. I think it might work out. But I, I mean, might bring the daily. The I time. might bring the daily so show change back. Your time? Uh, change your time. We'll see. Show or anything? I I really I love Forbidden Frontier, and I I really love that show. I find myself reading about all this stuff. <laughs> I was reading about Earth Grids. Um, before the show started uh, yeah, today, yeah, are crazy, crazy. And, yeah, and I just like, I I love the stuff. They're so, it, it's just so cool. Like that, this ancient universe, ancient human civilizations. I can't un, I, I can't turn that off. And that's yep. at a set time. And I love that show. So like, I will always hit that show, right? And that's yep. Sunday, and that's late for me. But base F Monday is also pretty late, and yep. but it's two so Monday, two Sunday. nights. Yeah, Sunday money. I could do that, right? Two nights late, and then the rest of the time I could just I go to sleep at a normal time and be up early and do things. Um, yep. Especially if it's like Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And it would be a morning show for us, right? A regular time show for you would be a morning show for us. I well, that's if show, I. Yeah. But that's if I do a daily show, right? And and I that's what I'm I'm trying to set up something different. I'm trying to create, right? And yep. so I'm actually working on a new channel. It's not. I'm not going to reveal it yet because we don't have a welcome video yet. But Nisha is going to be doing stuff on the vi- on the channel. Nice. I'm gonna be doing stuff. We're we're both going to be. There's a lot of stuff on this property that's really freaking cool. Like this house is from 1850. We have a freaking 100 year old 
wood wood stove in the house yeah. right we ha we have a fireplace that was built in this house that was actually like they used to build fireplaces and one of the fireplaces was was the ones that they built custom for this house it's just like i just so, got oh, cool geez. Mm. yeah it's just like and like there's a retaining wall that needs to be fixed i'm gonna like i want to make a video of me fixing this stuff and like we're gonna get chickens like we got a lot of cool things that i feel like are so i like love i love to watch yeah it's it's gonna nice. be kind of like like this a vlog slash you know project fixing stuff slash me making a tanto knife or i a, think that's a, perfect for you a vlog like to record yeah. everything you're doing instead of trying to figure out what lane you're in, like making a vlog and do everything you're interested in. I'm yeah, I think that's a smart. I'm move. gonna I'm gonna go mountain bike this <laughs> insane trail that's yep. three and a half hours from me. But like, and then something will happen, and then that will be like the highlight of the video that you could like. Yeah, I'll probably you know I mean? meet some crazy freaking mm -hmm. pro. Knowing yep. my luck, this yep. is how it works. I <laughs> I'm gonna film a video of me go like crawl going through the forest with a skateboard and like discovering yep. a skate ramp because there's literally a yep. I, I told you guys about the skate ramp right yep. yeah that's pretty i still haven't seen it i want to see the shit i didn't take a picture of it yet because it's it's like my neighbor's property but like it's in the forest yeah but the, it's not just a skate ramp it's the skate ramp but it's actually two skate ramps um are it's like at the edge of this property so it's my neighbor but I don't think anyone lives there. I think it's just kind of like they own the the plot and no one lives there anymore. And I'm just like, or it's like a true detective situation and there's some crazy fuck that's like <laughs> watching every movie. Got like dude. bodies like so, on ice and shit. You know what I'm call, saying? Like, be careful. careful. <laughs> it's interesting you should say that because <laughs> I've been so I've been mountain biking all over the place. And yeah. I dude, I have found the creepiest looking spots. With like okay. old, old broken down machines in the middle of nowhere the forest, I found a house that's that's in the middle of the forest. Right, it opens into a little clearing, and it's just a house that's just abandoned. Shh. But the, kids are getting like, cooked in there, bro. Hundred percent. Dude, what's like it? But like, <laughs> I'm like, I could I could film like the craziest <laughs> horror horror movie out here. Yeah. Just like ARG, something. bro. It'd be scary. That's what we were talking about. Yeah, but. That that's that's takes a lot of time. That, it does. That it takes so much planning I, and fucking I, I, time. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do yeah, that. I, I, that shit is I would so rather much. do like um a fifteen minute horror short. Yeah. You know, something like that. I'm I'm cooking I'm cooking something up. Okay. But that's that's what that's like the last thing I'm I'm worried about right now. Right now I'm worried about um I, I really just want to start making knives and rings. So I talked to and people know about the the rings. I, I have a few people that on my locals, there's a pinned comment about who wants a ring. And there's a few people that that's pretty um, dope. That, that is want dope. To, so I, I made my wedding ring. Nice. Uh, I made this it's fire just a silver ring. And I, I still have a lot of silver left over. Uh, I've made some jewelry. I might I made a silver leaf uh, that Nisha wears around her, her neck. And it's probably the coolest thing I think I've made. It's beautiful. It looks like a real leaf. It's like took, a hammer and like a bending. How do you know that you, you can get um, this stuff called silver clay and you can mold the clay however you want. Oh, and then you pour and, silver into it. Well, no, no, no. It is silver. It's silver clay. So once it's the once you let it dry. All right. Then you then you burn it. Oh, like a kiln, burns. like pottery type shit. Yeah, but with just a flame, like you know, like a torch. So you torch, and it burns the clay away and leaves the silver, and it's it what? stays in the state that it's in. Yeah, it's incredible. So what I've I did never was, heard of this. I took two leaves from the same plant of the same exact size. I like measure. I found like the most, I don't know, beautiful looking leaves, and they were about this big. It was like the perfect size, right? And I I had one facing this way, and then one upside down. So they were or they were both facing the same direction so that the, the top of the leaf was on one end and then the bottom of the leaf was on the other side and then i let it dry and i kind of shaped it a little bit into a leaf and then i burnt it and it's like the perfect leaf i did like i don't know clean up the edges a little bit so because it, it was just kind of like clay but then yep. uh, i kind of made it look like a leaf and now it's it looks like a freaking perfect leaf it's dope so you're That's basically like elrond like making fucking badass kind of <laughs> yeah. i I love working with material. I, I really enjoy it a lot. One of my favorite classes in sixth grade. I, in sixth grade, I had woodworking shop and plastics. Same, same dude. I did it sixth through eighth. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're, we're the same age. I had wood right, chop so. in sixth grade. Yeah. Dude, wood chop. It's amazing. I love yeah, that. I loved it. Working with I wood. love the yeah, smell it's... of the yeah. yeah that's it's fun. Dude. Such when you have a finished thought. product, that shit feels good, man. It does. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, All polished exactly. and sanded and shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Stained. I, dude, I freaking love it, man. I love it. So I got, uh, yeah. So once I get electricity in this barn, uh, it's a, it's freaking go time. Like I'm, dude, I'm hyped. And uh, nice. I started, I started making a knife today. I, I was like, I can't wait. I, I just want to freaking, I've been waiting for this electricity. It was supposed to be in today. And I just had, I had that spotlight that you saw. And yep. I was like, fuck it, I'm just going to try. And like, I started grinding and I realized my belt, I, I, it don't, it came with two belts and it's like 240 grit and like 180 grit. And it's like, it's not good for, um, getting rid of a lot of material. I need like an 860 grit belt. And I, I have ordered it. It's in the mail, but I haven't gotten it yet. But I'm happy to see uh, you like anyway. going for something that you want to do because you were like, you were like, I don't know what to do. And it's like, it's, I can, do you have a different energy now that you're enjoying what you're trying to do now? Totally yeah. different energy than you just had a few Thank- months ago. Well, you know why I, I had that feeling is because I knew that I, I was going to have a little one, right? Yeah. And I'm like, I want to be happy. I want to be happy doing what I'm doing. Yeah. And I like streaming. Don't get me wrong. Um, but I, I want to create. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, there's, so if I can like create and if I can splice those two worlds together, that's what I'm tr- attempting to do. That's and what you're going to do as long as you actually do it. That's, that's it. That's oh, that's exactly what's going to oh, happen. Oh, it's happening. Oh, it's happening. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I mean, and you look online. Dude, people love bushcrafting. Bro, people I love... that shit comes mm-hmm. up in my shit. Fucking hundreds of millions of views, bro. It comes mm-hmm. up in my shorts just like... Dude, so, I'm And I watch the whole board. video like, what is this? I don't even care. And I'm like, I, this looks fire. Bro, I walk by a boulder all the time with like an overhang. And I'm like, I could camp right there overnight and film it. You and should. You look online. It's... And it's like 2 million views, 3 million yes. views. I'm like, that's pretty cool. Why not? Paul, 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 you were going to say something. What were you going to say? Oh, dude, I've just seen channels that do that that blow up. Like that. I remember yeah. I showed you the one where the guy made his own like pond lake and then it's blown up into this crazy shit where he's got yeah. like, eagle towers. He's got like mm-hmm. a whole wildlife thing. And he everyone films wants... himself catching the bass. Is and that that Wayne, guy? Dude, yeah, he films himself catching yeah. the bass. They all have names. He puts them all back. Like it's crazy. <laughs> yeah. It's fucking insane. So but like that gets so many I views. So like, fu- yeah. I'm honestly curious what fish you have because you have a river. Like I'm wondering, like, could you fish trout? I do. That bad boy? Well, guess what? That's going to be the stuff I'm doing. I got all the fishing equipment. I'm going to be yeah. fishing. I mean, I have like everything is on the table. Like all the stuff, like if it involves going outside of my house, I'm going to film it and make a yep. video about it. Yeah. Fixing a retaining wall, fixing my, my, freaking wood fired hot tub like that needs to be fixed uh fishing or making a new bridge over the river because in the winter time the the river floods or it gets it raises like two or three feet it gets a lot he- uh deeper so my mm-hmm. bridge floods so i can't actually walk into the forest in the winter time so i'd like to rebuild um the the bridge so i can actually go into the river or go into that the forest like from, from from my property so and that then camping like like i love camping and i have this forest that's beautiful and these dude 400 500 years six hundred thousand years ago i have a a stone next to my house that has the date like 1382 or something right from like the from vikings living in this area so like these big yeah these big boulders that are here like vikings lived amongst like they did they they lived here so like it's pretty cool and i I just learned today millions of views type content it really is. Well, I'm excited. Yeah, I mean, and I, I, go go ahead. Sorry. Just, especially just when excited. you start with zero, yeah, and mm-hmm. they see it build, like they you get addicted to seeing the progress, and that yeah, like it, it just yep. exponentially, yep. Yep. snowballs. Yeah, yep. yeah, it's this it's gonna true. be fun. And I have a a snowboarding hill that's maybe four miles from my house that I just found, right as the snow was melting. I found this place, but it's like. Arbor actually sent me this snowboard when Tim like wanted to snowboard. He got everyone in the house snowboarding stuff. And I told Arbor and they're like, is it an Arbor board? And I'm like, no. And they're like, what's the, ad- <laughs> what's the address? And they, nice. <laughs> they, Don't use they, that, that shit. That was, yeah, that was the owner. Saying. That was Fucking the owner trash. who said that to me. <laughs> yeah, dude, he's garbage if it's not an arbor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So he's he sent me that, that. I mean, I mean, it's beautiful. So I, I'm gonna be, and I've never snowboarded before, ever. Never? So it's like, oh, well, shit. 
technically, when Tim got the snowboard stuff, I went down the hill in the backyard at in Maryland where that Tim's counts. house is. You snowboarded. I mean, <laughs> <That counts. laughs> I guess, right? But like, did you stay up? I, oh yeah, I okay. I absolutely shredded yeah, shredded down the hill. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So all I know is, if you put, I was a professional skateboarder that was more in the longboarding side of skateboarding. Now I was a freestyle skateboarder, park skater. I street skated also, uh, but I started on longboarding. So when I got on a snowboard, dude, it translated perfectly. I was like, I've heard that. My, I've heard people. This that, is my shit. Yeah. 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 yeah a nice so, transition. I've never. Yeah. You've never. Well, I got I, two. Well, when I was a when girl, when I had a here. girlfriend, I did. I said when I was a girl, but when I had it, this girl, I used to date. Now, yeah. Now you're married, right? So <laughs> yeah. yeah. When yeah, I, I was it. a girl. <laughs> Back when you were a girl. Uh, <laughs> anyway. Bruh. I didn't even catch that. Thank you, Carl. No worries. The glizzies make that's... sense now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, that's funny. Let's read some super chats. All right. Yeah, yeah. Let, let's catch up a little bit. Uh, Thomas Smith says, business. let's get let's get retarded. Uh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Extra Zero says, Call brings his double-sided lightsaber to the club. <laughs> wow wow that's Ooh, burn your insides that's right wow o only to the classy club uh, that's <laughs> right brings that to the classy place <laughs> bbdc for ten dollars what's up champions cheap plug for find out featuring dizzy dustin single and video this friday pre-order and help me get another number one over all the bumba clot whack reggae bumba bumba clot i've never bumba heard of that you never heard bumba clot no, what is, what is that? that? Oh, yeah. oh, when you say it like that, oh, yeah, I, I get it. I heard, oh, yeah, I heard that. Up. I'm not making Bum anything Bumble up. Clap. You're making that up. Bumble dog, clap. That's a real thing. <laughs> no, Bumble that's. Clap, bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's racist. Yeah, that was racist what? as fuck. That was Yo, racist. wow. Hold up. I'm Jeez. only talking. I'm talking like the trolls from World of Warcraft. Flawed. You nah, played that shit. You know what I'm talking about. I have, about. but it was still racist. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, are you calling the trolls black people? No, that's how their accent they speak like. Are that. you a troll? Because you can't yeah. say that if you're not a troll. Hundred percent, I'm a troll. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh okay. no! Oh my gosh! <laughs> uh, troll, uh, I got the troll right. pass. <laughs> Thank you, VBDC. Uh, VBDC again for five says, "Dang, I should have waited a minute to super chat." Huge congrats! Thank you so much, uh, Metastep. Thanks again for that fifty bones. That was huge. He said uh, for five. He says, "Totally had a feeling this was happening." Check PayPal. Right on. Right on. I did. nice. Cellular Dream says, "Congrats, Craig's. Make sure that kid plays Diablo three, not two. Shame on you, Cellular. <laughs> I, 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 I can I refund? Though. Can I refund this? Hold on. No, <laughs> give them, right. give them their money. Back. I, I give, take, <laughs> take this money back. Get out of here with that. <laughs> Takio for five says, "Congratulations, Adam and Nish. Thank you very much, Takio. Uh, Diz Dizji for ten says, "Congratulations. I'm so excited to hear the baby news." You've talked about wanting to be a dad for a long time, and I'm glad to hear your dream is finally coming true. You'll be an amazing dad. Thank you very much. That puts a really big smile on my face. I, I'm so excited. Uh, it's it's hard to describe, but I feel like you summed it up, and the people who have watched my show for as long as I've been doing it truly know uh, how much it means to me. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yarnwich, for 22 months, let me close that. Uh, Thank you very much, Yarnwich. Says, just had to pop on and say congratulations. So exciting. Thank you, Yarnwich. I appreciate that. The Magnum Express celebrating 33 months. Huge Woo. numbers out going on all over. Says, hail and congratulations. Thanks, Magnum. Uh, the Squid for Five says, you and your wife are going to forget all birth control methods and have at least four kids. Big families are cool. I'm one of six, and my dad is one of eight. Well, <laughs> my dad is, is one of 11. That's crazy. And, and I actually just found out I had a new uncle two years ago. So technically 12. Uh, and there could be more out there. I, I don't know. It's, it's shocking how, how big my family is. Like uh, Lady Freddie from Harry Potter. Oh, I guess I'll find out one day. Yeah, um, the Weasleys have a huge family. Okay, they do. Yeah, uh, yeah. I saw the Netflix adaptation of the Weasley family. Did you see that? They're, no. all, they're all black now. Wait, what? It's a joke. It's AI. I didn't. They, they, they add, I heard black in they, there though. 
Do you did you see what happened there? He was not paying attention at all, <laughs> and and heard black, and he was like, "Huh? <laughs> did someone you, say? Are, some... are you including me now?" And just like the fucking secret word. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny, uh, Lady Freddie. Thank you so much for that twenty dollar lemon. Uh, it's a big lemon kissing a little something. Uh, anyway, it's cute. Thank you, Lady Lady Freddie. Allison C says, "Huge congrats to you both. Thank you very much, Allison." Uh, Jason for five says, I started making rings like four months ago using ornate silver spoons and coins. So much fun. Want to start making epoxy ones too. Yeah, epoxy is cool. Um, I really like, are you talking about like making a groove and then like epoxying, you know, like dust into it? I, I've seen someone make a meteorite ring where they had wood on the outside and then they had like an epoxy ring of like meteorite dust and it like sparkled. It was, it, it was freaking cool. It was a cool ring. Um, I neat. thought it, yeah, I thought about doing the silver spoon stuff. I actually have some silver coins. I think they're right here, actually. Um, let me check. Uh, it should yeah, hold its yeah, value. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Well, the reason I got these, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I got a couple of silver coins uh, back in the day because you can, well, you could just melt them um, and use the silver, but you can also cut them out, cut the middle out. This is a a 50 cent Canadian silver piece. Um, I don't know, from like 18 something. Damn. Nin no, 1910, it says. But you could cut the middle out and so like. That's 100 and years old, over 100 years old. Oh, I guess it is. Yeah, yeah. Damn. But you cut the middle out and bend it and then make a ring out of it. And I just thought that was cool. I like the process a lot. Um, I think that's really cool. So I thought about doing that as well. And then like the spoon rings. I don't really like the spoon rings that much, but. Take a silver spoon, you cut it, and then like bend the end. Uh, it's kind of cool. I like molding, and also like this was from a straight piece of silver that I marked and then bent over, and then welded it together. But I really want to get into like sand molding. Do you know? Have you guys ever seen that? You know what I'm talking about? Uh -oh. Sand molding. Mm -hmm. So it's where you. I would love to get a 3D printer because what you do is you take you or you can carve it out of uh, wax. So you carve what you want the ring to be out of wax, right? You make the ring in wax. And then what you do is, is you'll get this sand that it's like, it's not like sand on a beach. It's like packing sand. And you'll take a box and you'll pack it full of the sand. And then you'll, um, well, you put, put the ring at the bottom and then you pack the sand around it in the box. And then you flip it over and then you put another piece box on and pack it full. And then you take it apart and you take the ring out and it leaves the perfect gap of what you made in the middle. So like mm. it, the sand holds firm and then you carve out like these pathways and then you pour molten silver or molten anything into it and it fills the gap. So you could basically make anything. I think I've seen that it. on the King of Random. Probably. Something like that on the King of Random. Right. So if you get a 3D printer, then you can, you could really like go nuts with making stuff. Yeah. So I, I more mm. things that I, I eventually see myself that like call was saying like you you start from zero and you like build your way up like i'll eventually get a, a 3d printer and start like upgrading and making stuff more and i'm just excited i i really i haven't felt this way in a long time about um life i i feel reinvigorated i mean i look at this this image like the, the first it's my child i'm gonna be a dad i will be a dad now like that 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 That's saying crazy. that like now I'm I know I'm gonna have a child like I want to be the the man that they look up to right I want to mm -hmm. be that person I want to be worth looking up to for my kid and I, I'm gonna do that I'm 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 gonna be that person so that that's why this whole thing uh, I I just you know I love it so uh, anyway let's see where was I last crow. Uh, says we want Adam to do the crate challenge. What is that? I, I bet. Wait, you don't know the tr crate challenge? Isn't like that walking like walking up on the crate? Yeah, isn't that like the uh, my people like don't black, do that black thing? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what isn't crate? that like What's isn't that like crate, uh, you know like you you know like <laughs> I knew that was going. Pe people from Africa do it, right? <laughs> what the hell is the crate challenge? <laughs> Wait, you don't know the crate challenge? Yo, no. you don't know. It's, it so, it's like so, a few it's years so stupid. It seems very dangerous. What is it? You'll see in a second. It's crazy. It's crazy. I don't want to. I don't want to climb on crates. Like, yeah. What the fuck is that about? I have some crates over here, so it kind of is a black thing. Hmm. 
Just got my supply of crates over here. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of prepared for it. I need a few more. <laughs> the crate challenge. Uh, I've seen people kick them I from bet, underneath. I feel like I would destroy the crate challenge. You, you because, think so? Yeah, you mm. know why? Because I, I was a professional skateboarder. I and see skateboarding it. is all about balance. And the crate challenge is you have to, if you have balance, you know that you have to maintain a downward force as you go up and over. And like I know how to control my balance on my feet very well. I like, want to see it now. When so, is like, the that? I got to see this it. challenge now. Like I'm imagining. Right, you know milk. Like, some... You know milk crates. You don't have the video. You know yeah. milk. I don't. I don't have a video. You, oh, I thought you, you were bringing pull... up a video. Okay. No, I. You, oh, no. you just like you run up and down like they stack milk crates like a pyramid. All right, and oh. then they run up and down it, and then people think it's funny to like kick them out and like yeah, ridiculous. watch people actually hurt themselves, and it's freaking terrible this challenge sounds fucked up <laughs> yeah it's horrible yeah it's, uh, it's george ridiculous. george says he can't make it uh which is sad he george. says he can't leave her uh cheers george um uh, there's only know, compilations i don't feel like i'll do all ridiculous. those yeah it's it's not a big deal yeah. so but, basically uh, they injure people while they I, I would never do that to someone i would feel so bad like Jesus. it's you're you're like acting it's like that stupid open. tiktok challenge where like the tabletop thing where like they would like push someone over but they would get down someone else would get under their legs so they them. Would, yep yeah and it's like yep. you're you could fucking kill somebody dude like what are you yeah. doing people are yep. stupid man anyway vbdc says uh for five says hey also flawed big match energy let's go make some noise in the chat if you'd watch flawed's wrestling podcast we're doing it we're doing it vbdc is going to be on there are you nice yeah, i yeah. love that i don't have any i'm not gonna, to I'm not gonna watch but... it but um yeah, good well, luck I mean, you <laughs> <laughs> but it's gonna I be like your, you're gonna I, mean, I don't care. There. I just don't care about wrestling anymore. Well, I used WrestleMania, to. WrestleMania. Yeah, it's it's uh, April. Oh, so you're doing like a reaction video or what? Well, so I'm just gonna be doing wrestling content. Like after you watch wrestling, you do recaps. I want to do like a weekly recap. I'm not BBDC on there, but also I want to like do like lists and like favorite wrestlers and like there's a lot of content you can make around things, not just reactions. Mm. You know, so that's what I plan to do. Got music, got wrestling, everything I'm interested in. You know, I, love that, no. I love but that. I love that. I plan on having my friends who aren't fans of wrestling come on, and then we explain why wrestling is good to them, just to <sighs> make people mad in the comments. Because wrestling, no, fans you know what? Passionate. I would be good on that. You know why? Because I loved mm. wrestling for a long time. Undertaker was my G. I've tombstoned mm. many of my friends uh, okay. back in the day. Okay. Um, I I was there when The Rock first came out. Mm. Right. Like, I remember Dude. when they Rock he first came when around. They hated him. Yeah, Dude, and like I hated him originally. He yeah. was awesome. You know, brother. like, yeah, right. Shut up, bitch. Anyway, that was like, um, that was after. That's he pretty good. Out, like, that's pretty hero. good. I think when right? he came out as a face originally. No, that sucks. That's pretty good. That yeah. sucks. That was absolutely terrible. Anyway. Chat, let him know if that uh, was good or not. Yeah. Say it one more time. All right, permanent mute. Uh, let's see. Uh, Juan Castle says, "Adam, welcome to fatherhood. Thank you so much. Mm. I appreciate that." So wait, who's Flaw's favorite uh, wrestler? Uh, I don't uh, know. He's muted. Michaels, but then AJ Styles. Wait, who? Shawn Michaels. All time. Yeah. So you're going sweet right. music number one. Yes. I like it. Yeah, yeah I like it. Guy, bro, if you if you pay attention, I, uh, he's like no, no, he's no. nasty. Shawn Michaels. I got respect for it. Some of the yeah. I got respect for it in the early two yeah. thousands was mm -hmm. in yeah insane, bro. Like he's it's definitely true. a worthy. Like I would put him on my Rushmore for sure. Okay. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he, he is. Actually, he was one of my favorite characters to use in. I couldn't tell you what 64 wrestling game I played. There was There's a so lot many. of them. And yeah. most of them were NWO really versus... good. Yeah, Why were the 64 wrestling games just awesome? So well, what's up with that? Dude, the chat, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It was the oh, yeah. time. Yes. PlayStation 64, like they had, they were on a fucking run for a second, bro. But the 64 wrestling games, they they were the best. Raw versus, I was, I uh, swear Raw versus you, I swear. SmackDown. If we played those, I would destroy you guys. Like I was okay. a professional hey, oh, N64. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure they have you. a way. Wow. I'm sure there's ports Let's online. Go. We can make Dude, this happen. There's got to be a way. Yeah, we can make Bring this it. happen. We can do it. There has to be a way. I, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, I have some experience in that game. Hey, I'm just saying, yeah. we there is WWE 2024 coming out within mm -hmm. like a month. I'll play that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, dude. Okay. Mm -hmm. If we could okay. play the N64 ones online, that would be incredible. Yeah, I know. I got to find that. There has to be. I wonder way. if we could. I wonder there if There has could. to be a way. I don't know. I don't know if like they have like an emulator or like, will they release it? Because Nintendo. Hear it? Hey! Yo! 
What's Garrett, good? Garrett, Did you finish real quick. We can't hear you. We can't hear you. What? what? Oh, I can now hear. We can. Now we can. Now I can, can hear. Can. I can hear. You're good. I, I want to say publicly, congratulations, yep. bro. Word. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Cats out of the bag. We can talk about it now. I yeah. heard. I heard. I'm yeah. terrified. For, I was terrified for the longest time. So, I, know. Say I told <laughs> yeah. I told these guys like a month and a half ago, and I'm like, don't ever say anything. You can't say a word. But I have to tell someone, and these guys are like my homies, so we know. Yeah. Super yeah. excited uh, for you, bro. So. All right, Garrett. Nintendo 64. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Wrestling. Mm. All right. Mm. WWE. Did you play any of them? Uh, no, because it was during oh. the period mm -hmm. that my my mom didn't allow me to watch wrestling. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Your yeah. mom is gangster though, so that's wild that's that she didn't let you watch wrestling. I know, dude, later on. <laughs> I don't know why she said that too. It doesn't make any sense. Whatever. No, I didn't know. Are they really good? Because I, I see them yeah. from time oh to time when I'm like, oh, my retro yeah. stuff. Dude, it was oh, yeah. a time. Check it you, you, you know the saying, like, uh, from the office. What? Retro. Oh, I got shit. This. So What's it's a uh, cupboard. Hold on. I wait, wait, wait. Let me, you're going full screen. Wow. With the Come drawer, on. bro. Yeah, with the drawer. So I have one of these from when I was a kid when we bought one. And yeah. I filled the sucker up, so I went and found one on eBay. Yes. Oh, so you got another one? So I got another one. <laughs> Are you going to fill it up? <laughs> you might be able to see it. It's that, it's you like, got to fill it up now. Like down there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we can't see it. That's fresh. I'm filling that sucker up. Nice. I like it. I like it. Nice. All right, so... Uh, I have a lot I'm of Super Chats. Chat. Uh, you guys are awesome. Thank you for Super Chatting me. Um, thank you. Seriously. Um, so I, we've already been going an hour. Nice, I want nice. to hit up. I, it's cool that Garrett's here. It's perfect. I want to talk about um, streaming fatigue. But also, I want to make fun of Hassan Piker. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. What and I'm in do? this. I'm in, I, I've been seeing him go viral, but I haven't been on Twitter. I'm going to right, I'm going to play it. I, I have it. I have it. Let me let me what? show you guys. This is curious. Let me. Uh, oh, shit. I got to go back because I was doing messaging. And there it is. Okay. And this one. Okay. I present to you Hassan Piker. But a real joke. Did you hear that? Did you guys hear that? Yeah, I heard it. Oh, okay. okay. It did sound like what Flood <laughs> right? said. Didn't he say it did? <laughs> Here we go. Wait, stream remote? Oh, no, that's him. Yes, a real job can be gruesome. A real Oh, come on. Twitter. Oh, I did see this. God, Twitter. Yeah, did Twitter. You, can you just... Very tired. <laughs> But a real job doesn't. Oh my Come god! On Twitter. Let me just refresh it. It's actually X now. Thanks a lot, Elon. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Same. A real job can be gruesome. A real. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> I have five hundred up, five hundred down. This is freaking that's, Twitter. Yeah. That's, that's un X. unreasonable. F and X. I'm it's sorry, Elon. X. Anyway, he says a real job can be <laughs> can be grueling. <laughs> Let me try it one more time. One more yeah, time. Yeah, you got it. You got it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. Yes. A real job can be gruesome. A real job. Bro, can is be the, grueling. Is right. Video specifically? Maybe. Maybe it's because of it. That maybe. Maybe. I mean, let me try. Let me try. Maybe because everybody's playing it. Oh, wow. can make you very 9. tired. Eight million. But a real job doesn't. Wait. Suck. Let me try to share it. Let me see if it works better. Yeah, you got to get it. Maybe okay, we're we're closer to the servers or something over here. I don't know. The servers. All right, there. All right, send it to you. All right, you got it over here. Let me pull this up. Like that. All right, share. Blam. Share audio. Blam. There we go. Let's try it. Yeah. A real job can be gruesome. A real job can make you very tired. But a real job doesn't suck the soul out of you. You know what I mean? <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with this guy? Streaming absolutely will. Dude. He said dude. streaming absolutely will. <laughs> oh, dude. Okay. He's a fucking dumb. Okay. Right, now bro. I want to start. I want to start by saying Hassan Piker is a freaking has a rich family. Yeah. All right. Yeah. He's a he's a trust fund baby. Mm -hmm. According to what I people can't yeah, no, he like is rich as absolutely. Yeah. yeah. You're yeah. saying okay. his family's loaded. Yes. Yeah. yeah, his family's loaded. Okay. So it's like Dude's a streamer because he can, and it's easy. And it's like, yeah. if you mm. if you have the the baseline to be a streamer like that, it's really easy to.
just continue doing it. And consistency is really the key to becoming a good streamer. Um, no matter if you're, it also good or helps bad when your whatever. uncle has a has a channel that has mad fucking viewers already, and then you start talking right. to that channel. And yeah, yeah. 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 Also, yeah, he's he, an immensely rich off of his own merit. I'll give yeah, him that. Like he's got his own, true. he's got his own audience that give him money that watches stuff. So he's got a ton of money on top of the money that he already had. Yeah, yeah. Right. Complaining mm-hmm. about streaming, like I'm not going to pretend that that streaming takes nothing out of you because it absolutely oh, it does. does. Right. But a real job. That, I'm not where fucking I'm torn. I'm not mowing yeah. lawns. I'm not digging right. ditches. I'm not. I'm not mining. Uh, fucking. <laughs> Cold, okay. <laughs> true, Cole. true. We're we're not out on the oil fields. That shit is draining. It's absolutely yeah. draining. To, or to working think McDonald's sitting, physically, to, physically yeah. draining. <laughs> that you're sitting in a chair, reacting, and sometimes not even reacting, just walking the fuck away. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's draining, dude. Mm. Bro, look, I, mean, I, I get it. I, I get it. Okay. But I, but also a real job is 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 more draining. Like streaming is yeah. draining for sure because yeah. it's like relative. Because you're also spending mad time not being able to do other things you want to do. Like it, it yeah. humans adapt. So whatever you do, you get sick of it. You know what I mean? And mm-hmm. streaming is that too. But it's not more draining than a fucking job. It's it's tick compared to a fucking yes. leaving my house, going somewhere and having to deal with a boss screaming down my yeah. fucking neck for me to do like yeah. it's there's no way that it's worse than that. I've yeah. worked both ends of the spectrum. I've been I, I did heating and air conditioning mm-hmm. where I was mm-hmm. installing uh, an HVAC system in an old house that I had to crawl through the like the untreated uh, as- not asbestos but like insulation the fiberglass right. stuff that was just like you just had to crawl through it to like get to the other side so you can install a vent you know in the summertime in Chicago when it's freaking 115 degrees humidity in this freaking mm. attic it's gross right hard work you know waking up at 6 a.m. to get on the job site by 7 um, like I worked that like trades like i enjoyed it it was great but then at the other end of the spectrum you know i was a model you know which is was great and i know that there's models that feel the same way that it's like, a it mid one at lot, that that it takes a lot out of you uh or an international supermodel uh, it's okay. <laughs> no, you but, gotta pet stuff on the back you can just let yeah, that out yeah, it, it's okay flex. uh no you know it's fine um <laughs> anyway uh, but then also I've been streaming and I worked mm. for someone who has is one of the biggest streamers out there, Tim Pool, right? I mean, it's like I've been on that side where uh it's political and that those politics did drive me kind of nuts, dude. That it part was, is draining. Well, even just talking to Tim was draining because <laughs> he's, a, he's an energy vampire. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I mean, I'm not trying to diss Tim right now. He is really good at what he does, but it's like yeah. it is draining to talk to someone like him every day, yeah. you know, yeah. especially when you were stuck in a house f- f- over COVID, oh, yeah. you know, nonstop around that energy. So it's like, I get th- what Hassan is saying, but like he is being the most dramatic bitch about it. Yes. Right? Yeah. Like yeah. soul draining? Like, no. No, dude. No, no. Take, it, taking second, calls bro. from customers is soul draining. Yes, Ooh, right. Yeah. right. It, where they I've want you that. to fix the shit that they can't fix themselves. That's soul yeah. draining. Yeah. All right. Like yeah. interacting Look, it, with customers for eight, twelve hours straight in one mm-hmm. shift. That's soul draining, man. Yeah. If Especially you're a streamer, like shit, yeah, and yes. not for thousands it, of dollars, <laughs> like like Hassan, exactly did, for what he yeah does. for like yeah. maybe a few thousand a month. Yeah, yeah. If if you're a streamer. And you feel like streaming is sucking your soul out of it, out of you. Get a job. You should not be streaming. Yeah, that should be the last thing that you should be doing. Or you're streaming the wrong thing. I did politics for a long time. I, I hate politics. I wasn't good at politics when I started the show with Tim. In fact, he told me we weren't going to talk about politics at all. Now, many of you gotcha. remember where that show went it, <laughs> he, he's he said he literally said to me the words <laughs> we are we'll, we will never say the word republican or democrat on this show like he said that to me before the show started we were supposed to do like <laughs> honestly more like forbidden frontier right that's what he really? wanted to do yeah. like weird wonky cool shit like that you know and i was like yeah that sounds great and it was like boom covid and like boom election season and it was like yeah. holy shit you know so like i kind of just fell into that and a lot of the people who followed me 
were looking for those political uh, takes. So I would then soak my brain of political stuff and I would do politics. And I'm like, why that am I doing so draining? I was that a skateboarder. So I was like a model that I all I did was like bring my guitar around the world and write songs. Right. I was a songwriter mm. and I, I used it to travel. That's really what I used that that industry for. And that's like, what am I doing? Like, I want to be a creator. And, and then I realized this, actually, because I've talked to these guys off air about this kind of thing. Like, I'm not happy doing this. Like, why? It's not the streaming. It's what, it's what I'm you're streaming. streaming. Yep. Exactly. Yeah. You have to find what you love. And I, I love to stream. I love you guys. And you guys, too. But uh, chat, like, you guys are amazing. You're the reason why chat I Chat facilitates everything. You know, we live here. Yeah. Where I'm at. You guys have followed me. There's people that are on, I think, 40 months of membership, which is just bonkers. Think about it. That you guys have been supporting uh, for this long, you know, and the excitement that you guys all had uh, when I showed you um, my child. That's uh, it's coming around August, I think. Is, is nice. around. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna give you the mm -hmm. exact dates, but or I thought well, it was Leo. Isn't well, it it is too, but Virgo's end of August. Hmm. Oh, okay, end of August. Yeah. Yeah, I think I Leo think it's like is, right on... is beginning of August. Where Mo is August twenty second, August twenty first. She's a Leo. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Well, I'm not. I'm not sure exactly, but uh, yeah. uh, I'm excited. I'm excited, right? So nice, nice, I've, nice. I've faced this. So like streaming has been on my mind a lot in the past couple of months. Like, what works on YouTube? What works? What can I bring to Rumble that isn't on Rumble? Uh, yep. There's a lot. Rumble's awesome, but there's not a lot of specific things. Yep. Like, I want to learn how to do something. It's not on Rumble. It's on YouTube. Yep. Yep. And True. so I'm going to be doing all of the stuff on Rumble and YouTube, right? I'm going to be uploading everything I do. I'm going to create a channel to mirror YouTube. They're going to be on both channels or both sites because I feel like Rumble is desperately missing the fun side of YouTube. It start Rumble it started with the free speech. Like you can go and speak there that is on YouTube. So like, People aren't going to YouTube to watch like how to make a Bowie knife or how to make yep. a, a kitchen uh, or a, a bushcrafting knife or bushcrafting right. or, or you know, just like random shit like that, which I love to do. And I want to do because I am on the edge of this forest. Uh, I want to make myself my own uh, forest axe. I was going to get a, a bronze for uh, Brook, the, the Swedish axe that I have, the my wood splitting axe. But then I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna make my own axe. I'm gonna yeah, make yeah. my own. Like That's I'm gonna get the equipment. It's very dwarven. Oh yeah. Right. Like I could spend three hundred dollars on a really beautiful axe from this company, or I could spend three hundred dollars like on the the piece of equipment that I know that is all I really need to make my own axe. And I have a few axes that I bought for like three dollars that are old and rusty. Ask. No, that's uh, that's. Uh, that's must be your, say it. your your vernacular, yeah. Axe. <laughs> yeah. It's uh, <laughs> yeah. I'm not I'm not I'm not asking you anything. <laughs> I'm, I'm talking about uh, yeah. <laughs> they're not they're not forest questions. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Can I ask you a question? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's funny. Uh, I I think uh, so, you know, and then Asmund Gold is now getting shit because. Yeah, I actually wait, I haven't wait, watched wait, wait, Asmund's wait, wait. video. He backed him up. He backed him up. He backed him up. Yeah, because he backed him up because I think mm -hmm. Asmund Asmund I, I've watched a lot of Asmund stuff. I I think he has an he's, he's the wow he's got a streamer. Huge, he's got a huge following, but he 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 does stream wow. But he like has cockroaches, he, he talks mm -hmm. about everything. He does that. He does anything <laughs> and everything, right? But yeah. I like his the way that he breaks things down. He's like a. I, I think he tries to just be a realist. I like that about Asmongold. I like the, his his energy of he doesn't give a shit. He he knows he's got roaches. I'm so sick of that fuck. shit with streamers just being like, I'm the fucking guy who's gonna be the fucking guy who just says the fucking thing that everyone's gonna be like, oh wow, he's the fucking guy who's the middle. And the... I'm so sick of that shit. So many people are Charlie Penguin, I... Charlie White, fucking Asmongold. It happens so much. Like I'm so sick of it. They gotta they gotta always gotta chime in like. <sighs> yeah, so fucking stupid. I hate. It was got a pipe up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm so yeah, sick of the internet. Like, <laughs> their that's opinion exactly, on everything. Yeah, the internet. That's what's yeah. kind of soul sucking. It's just the internet in general. Yeah. But it works. That's it what does. people they, they 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 like their 
you know, you know what it boils down to having a parasocial relationship with the streamer, right? True. The people that True. the reason he has 30,000 people that watch his live streams because they're hanging out not only with their friend, they're hanging out with the other people that are also their friends. So like they're friends in like conjunction with yeah. their their relationship with the streamer that they have right yeah many people i mean you guys have been watching me for a long time we I, you might feel like you I've walk never up to me before, and say hi so we're pretty and honestly social. you can you yeah. i would if someone walked up to me and this has actually happened has walked up to me and said are you adam and i'm like yeah and they're like Holy shit! Like we Fuck watched you. you a long time. This is from Tim. <laughs> <laughs> Tim uh, says his regards. Yeah, see, that's why you gotta be like, that depends. Like, who's asking? Maybe I'm Adam. I might be. No, I. Maybe you know, maybe. whatever. I. I don't think I make enemies. I. You know, I. Make, yeah, no, I'm, I don't think so. I'm sure there's some trans people that don't like me, or or some. <laughs> I, don't I don't know. know like, that was funny, dude. <laughs> yeah weird uh well because you used to be trans right I we talked you. about yeah, that yeah. earlier yeah that's right, <laughs> right. Uh, yeah Please. oh yeah back. i did hear about that yeah I'm, did you I'm glad you're on the other side of it you know yeah you're, i mean you're yeah. through it now it was it had to be strong yeah. it took a lot of work but i'm here now did did you see the trans m&m picture no. oh yeah where he's like nate he's like topless m&m M &M the man yeah yeah M &M M &M the man. He, he posted like this side profile with his shirt off and he just looked like I, Elliot, Hold on, I'm sorry. I always thought he looked like I'm Ellen. I always I'm thought he looked like Ellen. I'm not going to lie. What? I All right, I'm sorry in advance. Ellen. You got it? You I'm got it? I'm, I, I'm scrolling now. I know I put You said you're okay. sorry in advance is what you said? Yeah, I'm about to show you guys. What yeah. is this picture? It bro? looks really weird. Dude. Oh, boy. Wait, Eminem posted this. Yes. He posted Why? it himself? On purpose, yeah. What's wrong with this okay. guy? He has titties. <laughs> I said... I said... It looks like he's missing the chest scars. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he looks mm. like Megan Rapinoe. He yes. Yeah. Yeah. Or mm. everyone's saying Sinead, Sinead or Connor. Sinead O'Connor. Oh, Sinead O'Connor, yeah. I see that. I see that. I see that. Hold on, I vote M&M should last go last back to having the frosted blonde hair. I agree. Yeah. I, just, I don't like With this shark black hair. And shit. Go back to that. All right? yeah. Absolutely agree. That's how it should be. It's it's, shady. It, every time I see him, it just feels like are you dyeing your hair black? Like, are you? Why? <laughs> yeah, yeah. It doesn't, it doesn't look color? natural. It doesn't feel I, right. It doesn't, it doesn't feel, feel right. real, though. I, I just, I don't know. He's not the real Slim Shady anymore. He's, he's not. He's, he sat down. He's not. All right. He's cloned not. rappers, dude. Tom did a song about this. He did. Cloned, cloned rappers. Did. Tom is a conspiracy theorist. I, dude, I, lo I love it though. I yeah, love that side absolutely. of Tom, dude. <laughs> I just I, I, I want him to do more like songs about conspiracy theories. I fucking hate the clone rapper theory, though. I'm not gonna lie. That's one of the things that pisses me off. The most. I don't it's think it's real. People. I hate it. I don't think it's. I don't think it's real, except with Joe Biden. <laughs> yeah. See, I don't know about that. No, Joe I think Joe Biden just straight up guy. deteriorated. You know, <laughs> you've seen old people. Dude, sometimes they look fine. Sometimes they just look like. Wait, wait. I want to hear call. I want to hear call here. What? Go on. I am not propagating the idea that oh, but go on. politicians <laughs> that are oh, hold up, hold up. <laughs> I'm about to say some crazy shit. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's sit down. Let's go. Look, look, look. I am really truly I'm not saying I'm, I'm not go. saying that our politicians put on masks like it's mission impossible. But sometimes like when I look are. at Joe Biden, just Joe Biden, and maybe maybe also uh, a couple others like Nancy Michelle Pelosi. Obama. It looks like they don't even like. It looks like sometimes like they're wearing a rubber mask, bro. Like they look fucked up. Or like Biden looks like he's literally like turned off. Like it's like he's a robot. And he shuts down because <laughs> they have no soul. Their it's, soul has yeah. been sucked out of them, and their body is like an That's Edgar it. suit. It's just like dripping off of them because it's dead. Bro, what if they right. really were aliens or lizard Dude, people? Lizard. I mean, yeah, there's a couple. Really like Mitch, really Mitch McConnell. Aliens. Mitch McConnell That'd looks like a motherfucking lizard person, straight up. Like, they, they, they don't fuck with. Or like a Men in Black character you know it's weird. they really hate yeah. so it's like it's Elizabeth. weird how inhumane they are it's crazy to me how inhumane you know, they are see, so they flaw just hit it flaw just hit it like i'm not saying that i believe in lizard people i've never never seen lizard people weird, but dude. it does make sense that they're so uh terrible with their treatment of the society of people like it yeah, would, it would make like, sense like oh you're lizard weird. aliens lizard yeah. people do exist they're just regular people but with lizard brains, you know, way okay. back in the evolutionary okay. scale, and, right, and they're cold blooded. We, we developed cold blooded. We developed a small little strain. It's called psychopathy. All right, yeah, and there yeah. is a percentage of people mm. that are psychopaths that do not have empathy for other people, and they they commit evil acts, and they don't mm. even realize it. 
That's what the lizard brain is. That's what this the lizard person. They're, they're not literally about. a lizard like V under underneath skin. They take it off for a lizard. Right. Their brains have like this different makeup. It's wired different than us to where mm. they're just they act cold blooded. Mm. Why do they always like make it. it to old so age? Gavin Newsom. Gavin Newsom. Because they're freaking conniving, man. They, yeah. they yeah. killed everybody else around them. This is yeah. true. Good they guy, are cold blooded. Yeah. Fucked up. Cold blooded. They're lizard okay, people. Garrett, Garrett Cook took off his glasses real quick. They're lizard people. <laughs> All right, let me. I mean, you convince me. Let me uh, read read a couple more here and just catch up a little bit. Uh, oh shit, let me go back. Where was I? Boom. Oh, yeah, Thomas like, Smith like, says, "I got a friend whose dad had ten kids with his first wife and another ten with goodness. his second wife, Damn. and she helped he raise like, all twenty. She's a superstar on that one. In. Wow, that's he was getting it in. That guy fucks. Wow. Yeah, he was fucking bro. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> wow. Sure. That's amazing. Juan Castle. I don't know if I read this one, but I'm gonna read it. Uh, well, Adam, welcome to fatherhood. Many blessings ahead. Thank you very much. I don't think I read that one, so thanks, buddy. Carnell says. Cheers, Adam and Nish. I'm super excited for you both. Can we get a bang ring? In honor. Where is it? Where is it? Shit, do I not have it on here? Bang-a-ring! Nice. Bang ring. I can't. You know that reminds me. I was I was thinking. I was looking at Nish, and I'm like, I can't wait until my kids are old enough that I get to watch all my favorite movies with them for the first Best. time. It's the best. I Garrett, you, I've, I know, because you've mentioned it multiple times over the past. Because you know they're at that age, you're, you know, where mm-hmm. you're like, you're doing it multiple times too, because you got a couple different generations now. Yeah. And uh, also, by the way, I, I want your Land Before Time sweatshirt. Me it's too. Fucking, it's dope, isn't it? Oh, yeah, that's good. Wait, let me see. Let me see. He got it's so many compliments so in front of me. I think it's, I think it's in the washing machine. It's in the washing machine. Just, he's, he's been watching. He's been wearing it in a bunch of different videos. Yeah. Just, yeah, land before yeah. time. But I was like, "This is a Dude, nice sweater," and I thought fresh. I was the only person who thought that. And then everyone else was like, "I love that sweater," and I'm like, "Okay, so I'm not bugging." All is right. it little? No, is it like who's on the fire? No, it's, it's the whole squad, dude. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. like it's a fire sweater. Here, yeah, it's dope. You got oh, yeah, you, you can present it. it. Yeah, yeah, hold on. That shit is fire. Yeah, I get so many compliments on this. This wow. sweater, it's a nice sweater, bro. Dude, the squad, man, it's love a nice it. Fucking sweater. All of them, baby. Fresh. That movie yeah. was pretty dark. Like honestly, like he had to like it process was. the death dude, of his mom and his mother. Him, like, that scene when it's raining, dude. Kids, dude that's like worse than that. anything. It's so good. Kids yeah. need that. I'm sorry. You know what that? Absolutely. You know what that kid Absolutely. is? That is the the chi- the children's movie equivalent of having a father in the house. Mm. <laughs> yeah, you feel it. It's, well, I'm not joking. Bambi, Bambi did it for the generation and, before. And did you have a father? I didn't have a father, time. and I didn't see it. I'm sorry. You know, I didn't have a father. My bad. Why you bring that up right now? <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Oh, damn. My, I didn't mean to do you dirty no, like that, no, dog. Fuck that. I'm going to think about it all night. Where's my dad? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm right here, son. Okay. <laughs> Wait, wow. you're, you're my son. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Go back in your tower, retard. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I forgot to uh, send that I, to you. Can you send that to me, please? Yeah, I forgot to. I got you. Yeah, my son is twelve, about to be thirteen. So Perfect. I've opened up the R-rated movies. Oh yeah. yeah. so shit! We watched Alien yeah. a couple oh, weeks yeah. ago. Then we mm. followed it up with Aliens. Well, the mm. first movie we watched was The Thing, and it's so awesome Great. watching them experience it because he was just like, "Oh, oh, no. <laughs> oh no, oh no!" It was so good. Like it's the first time he was seeing it. You know, when he was seeing uh, the Alien, like in the shadows. Yeah. He was so funny. Dude. Have you like shown him alien. Predator yet? And Predator Two, it's on the list. It is Dude. on the list. Stargate, that's on the list as well. Fast Times at Ridgemont High. No. Okay. No. Right. I haven't seen that movie. Oh, movie I mean, I you know, don't need to. It's just like sex. I don't think I have. No. I haven't seen it. I've always seen me. the cover of it. At wait, like wait, 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 wait. This is a movie that is well known. Yeah. Yeah. That, that only, only flaw has seen. Yeah. This is a first. <laughs> we got a free. This is huge, people. You did it. We Blah, found so home. funny, man. Thank you. <laughs> Fucking finally. How many episodes did that take? Dude. <laughs> too many. Too many. <laughs> Way too many. Wow. That, that's that's surprising. That's crazy. That is uh, crazy. Hayden 75 for $25. Thank you so much. Says congrats, Kriggs. You're taking that jump into what life is all about. Things are going to change, and it's going to be a fun ride. 
You're going to make a great dad. I'm raising some right now. I can't wait to have my own kids someday. Nice. Thank you very much. I can't wait for you to have them as well. Uh, and man, thank you. I'm, I can't wait. It's, it's serious. Like I've never looked forward to something more than to meet, meet them. I, I don't know if it's a boy or a girl yet. So whatever it is, I, I can't wait to meet it. <laughs> so nice. <laughs> yeah. A uh, big floppa for five says, howdy, Adam. Wow. I'm a professional goldsmith and gemstone cutter. And would love to see more of your jewelry uh, work. I find fabrication videos fascinating. Thank you. I will be doing uh, jewelry smithing as well. Like that's part of. I, I love. I have. I love it a lot. I have all the equipment. I, I've had it for actually. I don't know five or six years now, and it's just I have a bag of like my gold. My well, it's silver smithing. I'm not a goldsmith, but um, I like working with silver. I can't wear nickel. So I, I can only wear silver, like pure silver. Like mm -hmm. I could tell you if something has nickel in it. You know, usually stainless steel has nickel. It's like a small nickel content. You're, are you like steel. allergic to it? I'm allergic to it. Yeah. So I break out and it's like quick. Wow. Dude, I'll if it's fake jewelry, dude, you just give it to me. I'll this wear it for a little bit and I'll fuck. tell you. Yeah, I, can't, dude. I literally just spell it away. Get that fake yeah. shit off me. <laughs> yeah, get that fake. I don't. I can't wear it on fake shit. Crap, <laughs> low quality jewelry. <laughs> yeah, it's. It, I think it's a good, interesting quality too. Because like, if you give me a silver coin, yeah, and and if it's real, I I could tell you if it's real within an hour. It's like uh, hold, you have like some on. vampiric. You have some vampiric senses, like a D and D character. Yeah, like you're like a mutant. You're like, like a mutant. Yeah, because like when Johnny Depp was in that Let's vampire that. movie, and he's like, like, he's holding like the silver fork and shit. He's like, this is cheap. There's not really silver, and it didn't burn his hand. So he's like, he called out their cheap ass fucking silverware. Oh, I like that. That's funny. <laughs> it is a little annoying, though. I'll be honest. Um, I can't wear watches. Oh, oh yeah, didn't you, yeah. Did, you yeah. Never, did you ever fix that watch, or it didn't work? I currently, I have the system that I have for it is, uh, I have. A piece of t-shirt that i cut and I, I the only thing i found was like the silicone with magnets in it which works um and i got this case so the outer edge doesn't touch my skin and then i still get a rash through the t-shirt dude yeah. so what is that like reptar I, or something what is that reptar well, you remember those watches a, you get the well no, it's a no it's a samsung um, oh, okay like, it just has that samsung like steel markers. back stainless steel backing well it's well, it's, yeah, it's like a stainless steel titanium, and then there's like this glass in the middle, but it doesn't matter any portion of it. And it sucks because, like, if that's the part that reads your vitals, right? Yeah. So if you're like mountain biking or whatever, but it still has GPS. And what I, I have to figure out, I think what I'm going to do is get like a thin leather strip or circle, cut it out perfectly, and put that there so that it's leather in between uh, enough, the watch and my skin. Enough separation. Yeah. But currently, it's annoying because I can't charge it through this, so it needs to be able to take off and put on. So it's annoying. annoying. I'm gonna figure it out, but it's a shame because I really want this now that I'm mountain biking too. Because it'll. Track I mean, you know, my, if, you, uh, if it never works how out, much you know, just mail it on over to me. No problem. <laughs> yeah. Well, no, my <laughs> my know. wife's my wife's been eyeing it. She's like, like empty, empty. Hmm, you sure it you? Uh, it's not working out for you, you know. <laughs> <laughs> It's a shame. Uh, VBDC says N N64 is peak console, period. Mm, it is. It is. Dude, when you would bloody up the opponent's face with the baseball Hold on. bat. Call, <sighs> make your case. Make your case. That it's the best? Yeah. yeah well, what were you, you going to say? Oh, it's just like, it's so satisfying. Like when you'd have like a, a Royal Rumble with you and your three friends. And like you would always like kind of like have alliances. And then you would like fucking hit someone in the back of the head with a baseball bat and betray them. And then you got to fucking mm. feud for the whole time. Dude, that game was so like technical and like a chess match with like, like, dude. I'm just saying, if we if we play, you might get countered quite a bit over and over. Okay. And over. <laughs> All just, right, right. Now, now, I I just want to say it does yeah. feel like it's the last true couch, uh, co-op console. Oh, now I know GameCube and PS2 era. Dream, Dreamcast came. Dreamcast came out after 64. GameCube also. Yeah. But it's like. I don't know. I didn't play GameCube. I didn't care about GameCube. GameCube was fire. PS2 was, fire. Was, was, was pretty fire. great as well. You do a lot yeah, of couch. Was you got yeah. the multi-tap. You can add four controllers. Yep. You can play a lot of True. Yep. Yep. True. 
PS2 it didn't, okay. come, it didn't come with the four. Yeah, that's my, I think yeah. that's my yeah. favorite one. Like yeah. Peak Magical. was PS2. The fucking games are on PS2 are so good. They're so innovative. So yep. many variety of different Back types of games. Had ability to like had ability. PlayStation Two was definitely the one. Yeah. Peak for me. Was yeah. For me. Yeah. That's like the last real couch co-op. We used to play Tekken. We used to run so yeah. much shit on that on PlayStation Two. That was before it was all online. Like there was still yeah. there was some PS2 yeah. online that was like as they were starting yeah. to get into it. But the next generation after that was all online, online. so it was yeah. separated everybody away, yeah. Yeah. which was on purpose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. that whole Absolutely. thing was to destroy the ability to just like one of your friends got the cool new hot game. Like let's all go over to that guy's house. They're like right you can't land party. Let's sleep way. over. Let's get some pizza. Everyone let's play. Oh, yeah, man. but I'm not gonna like for real. Like PS, uh, not PS, uh, N64, Golden Eye. Yeah, Golden Eye's yes. lit. Glover, oh, perfect oh, dark. Oh, fucking Glover, mm. Banjo Kazooie. Yeah, Banjo Kazooie. Yep. Yeah, sixty four had some Turok. They had some lit ass oh, games. Yeah. Oh. Turok three. Oh, yep. Dinosaur Seeds Hunter. of Evil. Yep. Uh, yeah, they had some yeah. shit over there. Dude, perfect dark. Perfect, perfect dark. dark. Perfect dark. Yeah, yeah I, I was too bored to play than that Golden game. Eye. It's better than Golden Eye. I said it, it. it was. It was an improvement made by the same people. They improved the controls and everything. It's way better than Golden Eye. They so improved on the all of the controls. Yeah, I'm a Golden Eye guy. My problem did you with play it, Perfect though, Dark. Is, yeah, I did, but I like Golden Eye. The problem with Perfect so Dark is if you were poor and you didn't have the game it. expansion pack, you That's couldn't true. play the whole game. You could That's only true. play like por- portion ah, of the game. I yeah. remember that. What? Yeah, I don't, yeah, even, I don't, I don't, I don't remember that. that. The 64. Remember that? Yeah. Uh huh. No. You know, Stadium was on 64 too. Pokemon was fucking lit. Mm, I wow. forgot about that. It's that a great wait, console. Which one? Which one? Which one? Pokemon Stadium. Oh my God! Pokemon yeah. Stadium was yeah. so Pokemon good. Pokemon Snap, dog. Yeah, Pokemon Snap. Oh, we would so, play that like shit so competitively. Like shit got fucking intense during Pokemon Stadium. Bro, it was good. That was like it might be okay. <laughs> that, I, it's it's a toss up between sixty four and sixty two. Right? Yeah, yeah, that's pretty so. close. That's pretty close. Check this but it's out. Like right after just PS2 kind of like died, that is when that whole era died too. Like when we yeah. go into the PS3 era, like that's a DS. Became... Oh, that's DS. Oh, this sounds small. off. Or is that, a, is that, no, is this it? is Game Boy Advance SP. Oh, SP. That's what it one is. I yeah. never had as a kid because again, that was poor. Hey, it's like this. It's got the OG one. <laughs> Oh, you got the blue too? Wow, the blue! Yeah. Hell yeah, my, dude. my man! What? What up, dog? That's Where'd you get hot. yours, Garrett? What? Where'd you get yours? You just got it? Uh, eBay. Mm, I bought it while yes. we were at dinner. Okay. Oh yeah. And my yeah, wife just you, bought yeah, one. You guys were talking about it. She made me all jealous. I was like, "Damn, I want one now." <laughs> mm, I went got one. Dude, my mom. Retro. My mom got me that one for Christmas. Oh, that's it's so nice. Nice. My mother didn't never got me a game system ever. Not even a game. She was like, "Yeah, I remember, dad, dude." Dad. My mom gave away our Super Nintendo to our cousins without telling us. And I dude, dude. how old were you? How old were you? Probably like, well, we had gotten the N64. So in my mom's oh. mind, she was like, let's be charitable. And in my mind, oh, I'm like, that. what have you done? Like, <laughs> no, nah, yeah. oh let's never be charitable ever. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so she gave away AVP. <laughs> she gave away Empire Strikes oh, Back. No. Like every, every gem. Yeah. They all got some. Oh. And I, had, I had to just like take the L. I was like, oh. Okay. Damn. Damn, that sucks. Yeah. Brutal. Yeah. Nice of my mom, though. I understand. But... No, sure. Nah. Yeah, but I love up. your mom, though. But yeah. That was fucked. Damn. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a rough, hit. dude. It was that's sad. A hit. Oh, my goodness. Juan Castle for 10 says, Flawed, what's your wrestling channel? You're going to give JD from NY a run for a spot? Yes, I am. I am. It's Big Match Flawed. That's what it's called. There's like I barely any big, subscribers big on it. I haven't match. posted anything. Go follow. Uh, big match flawed right now. Yeah, it's like Go big match it. John, big match John Cena on Rumble and YouTube, or just YouTube? No, no, just YouTube, what? just YouTube, just YouTube. Okay. Yeah, but uh, I go on should, Discord. We watch, should, we watch Raw. We watch uh, pay per views. That's yeah, pretty cool, I, actually. Yeah, I I go in and immediately regret it and leave. I that's saw, how, <laughs> I saw you step into one of those. <laughs> yeah, that's no. It's been a few now. I, I immediately <laughs> okay. leave. I immediately regret it. I haven't uh, watched it in like a week though. Did you jump Tombstone Tim or Ian? Oh my God! No, no, no! I, fr- I said friends. I tombstoned my friends. Um, no, no, Ian's my friend. I, I really like Ian a lot. Actually, he's awesome. Ian's cool. Uh, Ian's good. I don't people. think, I don't think Tim, uh, cares uh, at all. I don't know. I don't think he knows what a friend is. Uh, best Damn. wrestle of all time, Stone Cold. No, he's no, up there though. Stone Cold's legit. Stone Cold is the highest growth. He made the most money. Best wrestler WWE. of all time. He's though? not the best wrestler though. 
I don't no. say best, but like I certainly... like Stone Cold. Don't get me wrong. I like He's Stone good, Cold. Though. He is good. Best? Him and Bret Hart right. have been on some classics. All right, best. Best. Shawn Michaels. Or, okay. or like talking, today, hang on. in today's age, I'm going all AJ time, Styles. All time, all time, all time. I don't know who that is. I don't know the it's new hard. guys. I'm I talked to him Sean. one time. AJ, AJ Styles? Styles? Yeah, we were on a stream. We had him on uh, LWC one time. Yeah, mm. it was cool. I love AJ Styles, bro. That's my guy. Dusty. All time. Is that the guy top? with the mask? No, that, hell no. No, no, no. no. That's he's like down to earth. I don't know who like, uh, like a good old boy kind of. Yeah, yeah. he's from the country. Yeah. All time, all time, though. All time. I'm going Shawn Michaels. I didn't John watch. Michael. I didn't watch wrestling. Wrestling at all. Know, okay, call all Man, time. I mean, if I had to pick one, I can pick. Can I pick three? No, no one. one. <laughs> just one. Just one. You cheater. I don't want to do four. To, what about <laughs> six? <laughs> Top six. No. Can I do no. them all? Well, there's lots of different factors to what is the best wrestling. I don't care. It, I, yeah, no, but, for you. Can, can I pick choose? Randy Savage just because of the scene from yes. Bonesaw, like in yeah, yeah, Spider Man? You can. Who yeah, you picking, Carl? I'm gonna go Hulk Hogan, bro. Damn, ew! <laughs> Kick him off. Yeah. Get him out of here. No, I'm going Hulk Hogan. Nah, who picks Hulk I, Hogan? I stated the what do you mean? There are many factors. Who picks Hulk Hogan? What? Damn. Dude, he's popular, he was, isn't he? He's popular, but he's not the best. Okay. Well, as Flood's pointing out, there are factors. Bop, 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 bop. You chose. No, 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 no. You chose. No, you chose. There were you chose. You chose. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. All right, no. For, for me. <laughs> When I think about who my favorite versus who is the best, yeah. I kind I want to mix them because I I don't I think you have to love them also to be able to like have them be the the best. Yeah, mm. I gotta go with I gotta go with Undertaker. You said you have to love them. That was one of no, my. Three. I mean, I think I think Undertaker. He was the one that I Undertaker, always Undertaker's a good was, pick. Was hyped oh. and he's a fucking badass. He's a good Wait. pick. And they made him lose to Brock Lesnar, and everyone nice. was pissed. Really yeah. Yep. Yep. Yeah, that was fucked up, Dude, by the way, that they made him lose heard, to Brock Lesnar. Come on. I, I, I know, that's up. fucking lame. I think it was long time. Is. Damn, Flaud said fuck Undertaker. Shit. Well, no, 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 it's not Dude, fuck Undertaker. Brock I just Lesner, think that you got to He's a fuck fucking Undertaker. beast. Brock Lesnar is... I didn't say fuck Undertaker. <laughs> 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 wow. I just think that Brock Lesnar, it, it made a difference. Brock Lesnar became, like, the biggest monster in WWE after that and brought in so much money. Mm -hmm. It was, like, the True. right... Who else could have did it? And made it like matter. Like yeah, that. I think for Brock, it makes sense because he's mm. fucking, I, he's huge, and he that dude is in the UFC, and he's a real fighter yeah. too. Yeah, he fought actual fighter. people. He fucked. That's people what up. made it. That, yeah. yeah, he he's pretty badass. Undertaker yeah. is like a massive dude still. Like I went yeah. to a convention and he was in the like the hotel bar, just sitting at the bar, and he was just like. <laughs> <laughs> it's like oh my god! I would have <laughs> absolutely walked up to him and had him had him sign my chest. Oh hell yeah! <laughs> Great. <laughs> my nipple. <Tombstone> me. <laughs> <laughs> and he would have been like Tombstone. Not fuck that. Get this nigga out of here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm not signing. Cops are like, sorry, it's Undertaker. We have to allow him to assault you. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. It's in the Constitution. In the Constitution, All right, the Undertaker so, can fuck you up. <laughs> so one, thank you for that. It was a great discussion. But to finish your super chat, he said second to him, Sting from the WWE. That was my number one. E days. Woo! I like Sting actually a lot. Sting. Sting was cool, dude. That's you hear guy. his music and people would be like, "Where is he? Where is he? Mm. He's up in the rafters." <laughs> so, so, he'd be That's up true. there with his bat, just like looking down. I'm not a Sting Those guy. Good, that, man, that was, that was a part of I'm that. not a Sting guy. I'm no. Sting in the video no. games because he came out with a bat, which gave you the advantage in the game. Mm -hmm. But other than that, I'm I'm not a Sting guy. Just yeah. a cheater. I mean, yeah. he had he's <laughs> always had his cheater, bat yeah. with him. <laughs> he just I'm a just cheater. A cheater. <laughs> I mean, that's like a staple of wrestling is cheating, you know? Like, yeah, it's like, absolutely. Uh, it's in the Constitution. I'm a heel. That's true. He's a heel. He'll cheat lie. That's a good point. Eddie Guerrero. He was a heel? Yeah. Eddie Gu yeah. Oh, yeah, Eddie Guerrero. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, Forgot Sting was a face. Him. Sting was a face. He was? All the okay. time. Yeah, because everyone loved him because he sold so much merch. He like oh, yeah. He was kind of like an anti-hero where he yeah. looked like a scary dude, but he was mm. like, like yeah. the crow. It was like the yeah. crow meets a, yeah. a wrestling dude. It's pretty okay. cool. Yeah. Okay. I like. That was I like Martin. Martin. And, and he, he also crazy, he though. also Sting like smart. cashed in with Hulk Hogan and like Sean my or uh, yeah. Brett the Hitman Hart like at the peak when WCW was like yep. threatening to destroy WWE right before WWE like absorbed them like yep. fucking yep. lob like they were peaking at that point they were 
Yeah. They were good for them. Chris Jericho them. is another honorable mention for Ooh, best of all time. Yes. One. I like Jericho. This dude I like is Jericho. relevant to this day. I to dude, day, I tombstone winning. people and put them in the walls of Jericho. Those yeah, are the two, walls of Jericho two is classic. Dude, he kind right. of invented trolling in WWE. Yeah, he's hilarious. Say. Yeah, he's fucking I hilarious. Mm-hmm. I can see. Like, it. if you go watch his highlights, this dude is bro. He he reinvents himself over and over again, and is amazing every time he gets everything yeah. over he's so good all right let me let, let me uh let me move on and uh catch some of these rumble i haven't even gotten to the rumble chats at all rumble. So, rumble, because i gotta show rumble sub love shout out to my rumble homies uh v6 neon says suggest no panic button also known on youtube as fire monkey forge uh oh i'll definitely check that out thank you oh, oh you're talking about the uh uh probably the, like, the wood stuff yeah yeah it just it looks like uh another forge smithy stuff Mm. channel i love that stuff so thank you uh rake and night for 10 says what's up bitches can we remove froggy flood yes fucking guy Uh, this fucking guy hey what's up guys (laughs) (laughs) what i what i just moved uh i'm just i can mute him i i don't know how to remove him so oh oh, wait there he goes yeah turn your camera off for a little bit all right he is permanently uh i'll bring him back when he when i see you uh, when you come back i'll unmute you uh, anyway, there you go, Raken. That was ten dollars, so that's uh, that's at least thirty seconds. Uh, all right, Vault ninety five says Adam had a nineteen sixties Spock haircut last night on Forbidden Frontier. Did I? I feel I haven't done anything with my hair. I guess it's a little more. Spock. I had a hat on. Oh, let me un- unmute this guy. Sick. Okay, there we go. What is, what is Spock hair? So I was oh, trying yeah. to like bowl cut. It's like a bowl cut with it's, like bowl yeah. cut. Well, yeah, my hair looked kind of straight. It was what? just kind of like. It was like a, a little bit know. of hat hair. Dumb and Dumber, I, Lloyd Christmas hair. Yes. <laughs> okay. Actually, the great. Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay. I, I guess right. I did have that. Uh, V six nine says congratulations. When when's it due? Uh, sometime in August. Raken for twenty says congratulations, Krigler. Thank you very much, Raken. Uh, and then, well, V six says correction. When's is the little one due? Oh no, I got you. Um, well, it's an it right now. I don't know if it's a guy or a girl. So. Uh, who knows what it is? I guess I'll I'll have to wait till its preschool teacher tells me. Uh, Lord of the Re says, "What the fuck is up, Denny's? Love the good news, man. Happy for you both. God bless y'all, and I'll be praying everything goes perfectly and wishing you even more great things in the future." Cheers. Thank you very much, Re. You're, you're a G. Uh, Vault ninety five says, "Congratulations to the new incoming dad, Adam Krigler. That is awesome. Going to be an awesome dad who can teach wood and metalworking and skateboarding too." I. You have no idea how much skateboarding gear. I hope they like skateboarding because they're gonna get, <laughs> they're gonna get a bunch of skateboards throughout their lives. Um, uh, wishing best success. Now catch up to quarter black. Well, I mean, how many do you have? Like fifteen now? Sixteen? You know, it's hard. No, I can't, I lose no, count. Four. I lose count. You have four. Four. Forty four? or something like that. Yeah. No, you have four, right? Four. Four. Kids. Yeah. yeah. Four. No, it's like I think it's like sixteen. It was like 16 I just, when I was there last time. 16? It's hard to tell. There's so many faces yeah, and heads. It was and stuff so like many. Just, yeah. Right, right. But we had a foot race uh, when I left his house. Me yeah. And all <laughs> Straight up. <laughs> we literally and all the kids. Yeah. Yeah, right they're like, we're going to race you to the side. Let's go right now. You can't leave. We're going to race. <laughs> it was crazy. <laughs> I love that. That's fantastic. Yeah. Uh, Vault 95 says, Adam, with the abandoned house, how about filming a pioneering story of explorers finding it, fixing it up, and starting a beautiful, productive family? Maybe a family cobbled together like in Godzilla One. Uh, it's locked. It's it's it looks abandoned, but it it's it has windows and the doors locked. Um, I think I, I it's not like disheveled. You know, it's still like it's just it's just on a property that just looks like no one lives there in the middle of the woods. Doesn't make any sense that it's there, but it's you know. It's cool. I like the idea, though. Don't get me wrong. Um, I do have ideas for what I can film in the forest. Diana Francisco for ten dollars. Thank you very much, Diana. Says, "Am I dreaming? I have listened to you talk about being a dad for years, and now that's that it's real is some of the best news ever. So much love to you, Nisha, and Mama Craig's bigger family. Thank you, Diana. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. It's true. It's really happening, and uh, I can't wait." Uh, Diane again says, "Call, so good to see you again. Hugs to you and Tigra. Flood, what love to you and Mo. Yeah, man, we miss you when you're gone, buddy. Uh, you. Did you wait? Did you just come back? Did you hear the whole thing? I did. I heard Diana saying, "What's up?" Oh, okay, good, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, perfect timing. You just got back right when, uh, right when I read that. 
I did. Diana says, Garrett, always good to see you. God bless your family. Um, Thank you. Amen. Yeah. And I noticed that uh, Flaw didn't get any love from Diana Francisco. So <laughs> I just want to, Flaw's not here, but I want to, not even I'm here. Gonna point, I'm going to point that out to him when he, when he gets back. <laughs> just because <laughs> Diana Francisco is fantastic. So I got to really rub it in, you know, salt in the wound. Uh, Lord of the Re says streaming isn't the most soul sucking job out there. Even I can do it. I joined my first stream last Thursday evening just to talk about music for three hours. Definitely more fun than my day job. Well, you were streaming about something that you love. That's the key. Yeah. And that people who stream things that they hate, like yeah, it's going to, you do anything you hate. Like what, but why would you stream shit you hate? Like that sucks. Yeah. Uh, oh, flawed. Now that you're back, I just want to let you know, Diana Francisco gave love to everyone but you. Uh, anyway, <laughs> wow. uh, this is what we do today. <laughs> okay, Diana. All You're right. literally the only person that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no kind word. Lord of the Rings right. says, thinking about making a regular thing. Awesome. You should. A while ago, I got an idea for a weekly show. I think I might actually make it a regular thing. Y'all have been a huge inspiration to go and do the thing. Nice. Long walks music. It's adequate. Oh, I, I follow. Anyway. Me too. He didn't yeah. actually say that. That was just free advertising for you. Right? Oh, gotcha. nice. Uh, Pepe, Pepe Payne for $20. Thank you, Pepe. He says soul draining is being mortared and shot at so true. much that you no longer acknowledge it really happening. That true, yeah. is true soul stealing. That's facts, dude. Absolutely. Yeah. People, yeah. That's facts, dude. For Thousands sure. of people tune in for me. Oh, this sucks so much. <laughs> I know. Yeah. While, he, while he wears a Rolex hat, <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude, that crazy. kind of shit. But also, like, some of the, I've seen some other streamers who have like these crazy ass wish lists. And they're like, oh my god, thank you so much for the free fucking like PS Five and eight. sixty thousand dollars is like my crazy. Yeah, people shit. giving me stuff like that, you know? Yeah, stuff but like they'll have like a whole much. like list, yeah. like a whole Christmas list of things like, and they'll get it, and then they'll like yeah. complain and be like, oh my god, it's so hard. It's yep. so hard getting this Gucci bag. Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> Into the Gucci bag. <laughs> the one I wanted was like man, literally though. Like line. there are there are simps that will buy these people Gucci bags and they'll like yep. you know, mm -hmm. kind of complain. It's so awful, dude. I mean, I, I like this. I, I throw this in my Gucci bag pile over here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just the pile. <laughs> huge mountain of fucking like, hundreds of thousands of dollars of Gucci bags. <laughs> Remember that show on MTV? It was like Sweet Sixteen, where girls would get yeah, like, they'd be mad, fucking crazy ass Lamborghinis I and shit. Be like, like, I didn't want that. It's the wrong, <laughs> yeah, yeah, the like, wrong color. <laughs> imagine being that. Like, oh, Whoo. yeah, I wanted the pink Lambo. Fuck. <laughs> there, there's a point in streamers' lives when they get too big and yeah. mm -hmm. they they stop seeing the audience and start seeing dollar signs and yeah. i yeah. never want that to happen i it definitely happened to tim i i it was sickening when i saw it i didn't i didn't know right yeah. i just i didn't see that side of him until i saw that side of him and i was like I, you can't unsee it when someone is doing that and like that's why i like you guys like i've watched all of your guys's content i i enjoy all of your guys's content and uh it, it, and andreas and george they're not here right now but uh, you know all the guys on this panel it's something that we all share i i think myself included is we appreciate the audience we Absolutely. Keep, we appreciate mm -hmm. the people and that friends. show up for us yeah you know it's just like, man you you lose sight of that that's when it becomes soul draining because you start attaching your own value to the numbers yep you know and and yep. the numbers start like like you start getting depressed it's actually a thing like people get depressed if their numbers go down and it's like man yeah. it's happened to me too because like yeah. i mean youtube youtube's been shitting on me for years and i just like yeah. there's a point where i just like i stopped caring yep. and man did i feel so much better i'm Damn. like oh shit when i don't care then fuck i have fun and like yep. i i'd still do fairly good and it's because of you guys the audience and yep. you, you guys doing base staff with me is freaking awesome and and Garrett, yep, dude. Can't thank, miss it. thank you for bringing me on Forbidden Frontier. You know, without you, I wouldn't have yeah. been on that show. And it's one of my favorite things to do every week. And it's kind of given me a new obsession in life, which is just yeah. like knowing more about that stuff. And it's crazy. Yeah. We missed you yesterday, but. Uh, oh, no, man. It was a great show, though. It was a great show. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. Any streamer is nothing without their audience. Like people Fact. give Fact. their time, and their time is literally the most valuable resource that there is. And like, I want to I yep. watch this. I want to support you. Like, 
If you have, yeah. dude, when you think about the people that stream video games too, or just stream, like 99% of people Anything. that stream get zero viewers. Absolutely zero. true. Literally Absolutely. zero. So when you have one person that's yep. like, I can't wait for this you're person already to be like, you're, you're already, already winning. winning. Yep. Yeah. So true. Yep. Yeah. That's a fact. People don't think about it that way, you know? Yep. They should. They should. I was talking, they, I was talking to some guy during the bachelor party trip about merch. And how Zorbu? sometimes you'll buy merch. Yeah, it was, it was me and Zorbu. We were talking about uh, <laughs> when you buy some merch from from. Uh, hey, there you go. Yeah, he, yeah. Uh, from some streamer, the like it, it's trash. You know, it's like the shit's peeling yeah. off or it falls apart. And like, if you come to a meetup and you know who I am, one awesome. If you watch my content, awesome. If you want yep. to buy something from me, holy shit, awesome. Awesome. I stole my merch. I'm gonna from you. make. Well, I gave it to you, bro. No, I stole uh, it. Okay, you really you didn't have it. a choice. <laughs> just went to the boxes just yeah. rifling some free yeah. shit. I was like, yeah. if you if you want to go that far and you want to buy something from me, I want to make sure that thing is yeah. good quality. You yeah. know, yeah. I don't want to like trash you because like I respect the fact that you even watch my stuff. Like, yep, thank you so much. So that's yeah, that's why the, I don't really have merch. That's are, because that's I why I ordered right. a bunch of this shit because I wanted to make sure it was good. And I'm like, yeah, it's actually really quality stuff. You gotta I'm test pretty, the product, of course. Yep. Pretty glad, yep. pretty glad about that. So, um, mm -hmm. yeah. And you can't right. see my mouse pad, but it's pretty dope, dude. Just I need a mouse pad, so I'm probably gonna buy one. It's one. dope. Yeah. Uh, King Deplorable's got one. I I gave him one because he I don't remember why, but because he's a dope mod. Oh, because I got an extra one, and I was like, "Who wants it?" And, and King's like, "I'll take it." And I'm like, "Yeah, let me get you one." And then I looked at like how much it was gonna cost to ship it, and it was like, it was cheaper to just order a I new one, one from the website straight to him and i was like uh, all right yeah. <laughs> there you go buddy <laughs> <laughs> so yeah i just did that that was, that was pretty funny so uh anyway pepe just to finish reading it um he says just getting through it uh, of course he was talking about what soul draining really is but then yeah. he says congrats big homie thank you pepe fan i appreciate mm -hmm. you mate and all your support over the years uh vault 95 survivor says if you or anyone is having a soul sucking problem with the internet you are using the internet wrong facts, facts. to facts. whom this applies analyze your usage exactly you know, I, someone said something um who was it? i it, it was probably like hotep or something uh hotep jesus he probably i think he posted i think so yeah i think I if you're that. yeah if you if you're like feeling depressed you're scrolling too much yeah or something something like that you know and it's like that's facts. That's Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, I was feeling that really hard last uh, winter. Right. And I was like, this, I'm, I'm just spending so much time on Twitter, and it's just feeling that. like everything is that. so depressing. So I just straight cut it for like two months. I, I meant to just cut it for a week. But then I was like, oh, this is so nice. This is nice. Yeah. I just yeah. kept yeah. it going. I've, I've kind of like gotten back into it a little bit, but I've definitely changed the way I interact with it. Same. And it's did mm. so much better, but yeah, absolutely, yeah. you're using the internet wrong if you're if you're feeling that way, and you should mm -hmm. change. You should change it. I barely post on Twitter now, and I was yeah. like heavy on Twitter for a while, and it's like Same. it's so much easier just not to, you know. Yeah, mm -hmm. dude, like, I've, I've, I've caught myself yeah. wanting to like squawk on Twitter, and then I'm like, why am I typing this? Thing? Yeah, why do I care? I know. I like, like, go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Why does this matter? <laughs> and then yeah. you go, ah, oh, because it yeah. doesn't fucking actually matter. Yeah. <laughs> and you go, yeah. let's go outside. Let's go do something. That's good. true. Let's go yep. make something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, V6 Neon says regarding cloning, Dolly the sheep who was a clone aged faster and had many old age problems like arthritis. Damn. Yeah, interesting. Really? Interesting. Okay. I didn't. Even, yeah, it's never as good that. as the, the original, right? The copy is never, never as good as the original. Yeah, mm. makes sense. Uh, let's talk about uh, celebrating one month as a member. Thank you. Let's talk about says congratulations adam even though flawed let it slip a couple weeks ago no 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 i didn't it wasn't no no no, no, no. it wasn't flawed it, was it was andreas i let nothing it was slip. andreas it was andreas uh and notice no one noticed except a couple of us you'll be a great father god bless thank you you didn't even know yeah. this motherfucker Just how, <laughs> you had it wrong? Did, yeah wait but wait how I like how people think it was flawed. <laughs> yeah, I'm black. Flawed, I'm you're black like, wow <laughs> damn i'm black Unreliable. and reliable <laughs> even though it was andreas it was still flawed <laughs> you know what oh, i'm sorry <laughs> my bad <laughs> I, I i was mad at, at andreas but i was like i don't think i even noticed and andreas is such he's like a like a puppy in his excitement he was just yeah. like he was like i'm so excited just, for you that i'm telling everyone 
Yeah, well, I was I was going on a list of like why I don't regret moving on from the Tim Pool show, and I was yeah. like, I love my life, I got this, I got this. And he's like, and you're gonna be a dad, you know? Yeah. And I was like, right. all right, everyone, that's my show. And then I like, <laughs> and <it's> so <laughs> I know. I thought you didn't like, hear him the way you ended it. I was like, oh, he just didn't hear that. Okay. That's well, fine. I ignored it because I yeah. was like, if if I call attention to this right now, yeah. people are gonna if I get mad right now. If I if if I do anything, <laughs> people are going to be like, "Whoa, wait a minute!" But if I ignore yep. it, they might think like Keeps because I've I've talked about wanting to be a dad, and the reason why I, I, I moved this moved here is to be a dad. So like, it's going to happen. Well, I mean, now yep. it's actually happening. So to me, I'm like this. Why, Andreas? <laughs> you know, man. But he, he, you, you have no idea. He's apologized a million times to me. So yeah, he sent me a uh, gif of him hanging I've, himself. So I, 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 <laughs> yeah, right oh, after. Oh, I was like, bro, just try to talk to him. <laughs> yeah, I, I've, I've since forgiven him. I, I, yeah. I've, I've, I talked to him. I've, it's just. You know, it is what it is. It's a dark tweet, so. though. Yeah, I was like, it's not that uh, serious. I mean, it's serious, but it's not that serious. <laughs> Thor for ten dollars says Rumble has been growing like mad, and there's some great new creators there, like Pixel Kittens and Pudge, who have been bringing the good times. I Pudge. love hearing it. I love. Pudge. I, I love hearing it. Yeah, I'm gonna. That, I want that. I want to bring the bushcrafting and knife making and stuff. You know, and and I don't know what I'm doing. I, I've never do done it, it before. Just but I'm gonna it. you're gonna if you want to join me on my journey, everything that I've ever worked hard on in my life, I've become pro on. I'm not joking. Like if I if I wanted like I started skateboarding and I just went that went pro. Like I just yeah. that's I just focus and like I could feel in my bones that I want to learn how to make knives. That's and I'm I gonna am. do it and I'm gonna film everything. So oh, yeah. I know it and, and I'm fucking I'm gonna, do it. So that's how I do too, bro. Too. You're mm -hmm. yeah. you're you're committed when you think when you want to do something. That's the same thing. Oh yeah, I'm yeah. I'm I'm there. I'm there with it right now. It's awesome. Mm -hmm. Um, let's see. Uh, where was I? Uh, oh, BBDC says Pokemon Snap for 64 is the most chill game ever. I, it's not even. Bro, I was talking about. I never, fun. I never played it. I never it's played like it. Fun. You just ride around like, in a, like a little train things. and you take pictures of Pokemon, man. But you also you have to like mm. you have to get them. You can make them evolve. You can like throw things. Yeah, into along the volcano the way. and knock them into the volcano and bring them out and like you can get different. You have to like unlock secrets to like figure out how to get all mm. the Pokemon to get pictures of them. It's fun. It's a fun fucking game. Nerd! It's a puzzle game. It's a I'm puzzle game yes. with the camera. <laughs> bro, you never played it. No, I like the new one though. on Switch. That's the only Pokemon game I played. I played yeah. Red. Really? I played Red. I, but I didn't I get yellow, just like the first gold world. I played mm. Arceus. Dude, I can't Arceus stand the fun. Switch. I, I don't know. Yeah, why. Switch is trash now. Nah, I'm sick of it now. Nah, I'm not gonna lie. I'm sick no, of it. the reason I'm dude, with Garrett. I like the Switch. My hand I'm no, sick of no, it. I, I my hands are too big. Don't, don't, it's just bro, you gotta get the thing Call talked about. Call got me on. I have the bigger grips though. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, grips, dude, I've got help. it too. They help, and I only want to play Switch handheld because it's it's a handheld fucking system. You know. Look, you have the you have the I, grips, but you have my grips. The freaking, I don't Are they know, the right grips? I got, I got these these freaking grips. Turn them around. Turn them around. Oh, oh, those, they're, they're not the same. They're not the same. They're not the same. No, that's, that's not, the, not same. the same. That's not no. them. They're not. It's not enough. No, it's not bad. It's they're not bad actually. My issue but, with the Switch is the lack of games. That's my issue with it. True. It's not even that. It's not true. the handheld. The hand I played, I played Mario, the games. Though. The new Mario. The old, I don't dude, all the games Mario. for the Switch that I got. Mario's good. Games that are the nostalgia games. I already freaking beat, you know? It's like, yeah. yeah. It's it's definitely not geared games. towards gamers, like hardcore yeah. gamers. The Switch. Or, it, yeah. It's yeah. geared it's towards like casual. Like, yeah. if you want to get a family together, yeah. Yeah. Like, if you're on an airplane. When we played Mario Party at your house, that was fucking lit. That That's was so fire. fun playing Super Smash Bros. That was lit. Like if you have mm. a, it's couch co-op, so it's fun yes. like that. You know, yeah, yeah. It's definitely limited. Limited. Yeah. My yeah. my Steam Deck is incredible. I barely. It's use hard mine. to. I want to get one, dude. I I yeah, use mine mean. whenever I go to my in-laws. Like I'll just grab it and. Just, so I don't use it often, but when I use it, I'm like, this thing's fucking awesome. You know what I have? I have what? glasses that you can plug into them and watch the screen in your glasses. The Whoa. Steam Deck? Yeah, yeah what? they're they're called Air. They're called N4 Airs, bro. And N4 you plug Airs. them in, and they the screen shows up in your glasses, and you can play it like just looking Jesus. into your glasses. Yeah, 
What the yeah, hell? I have that. I forgot to tell that's you guys. That's pretty yeah. elite, honestly. That's cool. Lich. It is lit. That's like Hold dystopian on. slash really cool. Yeah, I want dystopian slash. I want one. I want to see that. I want five. Sign me up for the dystopian future because well, it sounds cool. I mean, have it you guys? Really cool. Have you like played VR for? Oh length? yeah. I bought. Yeah, I was early have... adopter on the Vive, so I have okay. like the Vive uh, two, like the very first version of the Vive two. Where's my bag, man? Uh, so yeah, I've been playing it for fucking oh, like a on. decade at this point. Call. I- I'm glad that it's like slowly which, gaining which what? What? Do you play VR at all? Oh yeah, not much. But dude, when I have it's immersive, and like I played a horror game, it's fucking intense. Mm. Like it's fun. Like oh shit. Yeah, dude. Yeah. I-, yeah. I have the PS4 VR. Yeah, how's and- that? I loved it, man. Uh, it's dude, VR is awesome. One of the best games I played was so it was, it was like a, a mech fighting game in an arena setting. The, Rick, yeah, Ooh, it was shit. awesome. You take oh, they the, straight up look like yeah, what? So if you look, what? they have Whoa. these little look like Ray Bans, but they're kind of heavy. But they have these glasses inside that act as see like through. You can see through it. Yeah, I can see you if I put these on. Yeah, but also oh. you can see the screen. What? Yeah. That's oh crazy. shit! The Those are fly. Rectangle, bro. It's crazy. I, They're dope. I think future generations are gonna get down on the freaking VR. Like yeah. this Ready guy, Player One. This guy gifted me, yeah. uh, my family, the, the Oculus. Yeah. Oculus. And my son was just oh, like, "Oh, that's cool." I'm just yeah. playing this all the time. He just he was playing like a it's some lame. monkey game where he was a he was like a eight yeah. They put me on that game. <laughs> they taught me. Yeah. That. They showed me that game. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna play the shit out of that game. Yeah, it's fun. I love my VR. I'm not gonna lie. That's really cool. Really, really cool. Yeah, I love the VR too. My favorite thing about VR is my favorite thing about a lot of my favorite games is I get to play with my friends. And my buddy had PSVR also. So we were playing these games together. And there's nothing more fun than looking over and seeing your buddy who's like, this is awesome. And he's like (laughs) looking at me. If I hear him in my ear and I I see him and it looks like we're next to each other. And then we got zombies and we're like, wow, bro. So let's do a base. This is awesome. VR, bro. We all have different VR systems. That's the problem. But but, but but you can link them. If you use steam, can you plug yours into the computer? I don't have steam. I have a PS VR. So like PlayStation, Uh, he's got vive or Oculus. That's Facebook. That's Oc- different yeah. than like, yeah. I, dude. That's so the Vive problem, and the man. Oculus. They both work on Steam. Yeah, you can use those for Steam because you can use PC yeah. VR. Mm. Okay. So the Oculus is and the Oculus is like eventually dollars. I think we'll get there. I don't want so the Oculus. I, so if you I have bought to, you have a VR, yeah, which one should I buy? Facebook. Which one? You should buy the Oculus. Probably, whatever works with Steam. That's what I would. Get, they the all Vive. do. All the Oculuses do. But mm. the Vive is my buddy. Um, I really like the Vive. He he got the new for me. Yeah, just... But dude, he swears by. It. He says it's, it's nice, it's, but it's just it's nice as fuck. Right? Yeah, it's, 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 it's like a thousand. One. It's like a thousand bucks though, yeah. right? It's, it's the nicest something. one. Yeah, it's, it's, like a, yeah it's like a PC. Yeah, it's the oh, yeah, best yeah. one. Yeah, it's that's the why best the Oculus. One. I just like it's like cheap, but you can also use it on Steam, so it's like easier. Wait, like, did, the you, quality did you get a new one or something? The Oculus. Yeah, did you get a new VR system? Because you gave yours to him. No, no, I had multiple. Mo had one too, but she doesn't like it. So I get mm-hmm. actually uh, I bought my cousin like, some like I I bought everyone that's some. Cool. <laughs> yeah. So I love that. About it. Like, like the, the price is low because enough you to get play in. in yes. You want to play the games yeah. with them? Exactly, yeah. dude. I, I, I dude, I get it. One. Yeah, dude, you're fucking awesome. Uh, anyway, <laughs> it was pretty G. Don't don't tell yourself I said that. Wait. Thank um, you. N- never don't mind. tell yourself you said. <laughs> 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 V69 says Trump sold the Trump International Hotel in DC for 375 mil at the peak of the market in 2022. Less than mm. two years later, the new owner just defaulted on a $285 million loan related to property after rebranding it. Oof. Ouch. Yeah, that I have actually a, f- a bunch of articles talking about like that all that shit, but uh George isn't here, so we're not we're not even gonna go there. Um, let's talk about this uh at last. Oh, I got let me just read there's like three more super chats and then uh We'll, we'll get to this last story. I know it's already late, but like, I don't give a shit. Whatever. Um, bacon stuffed donut. Nice. Mm. That sounds that sounds delicious. Let's be real. It sounds it delicious. Does. I can't eat it, but it sounds good. Yeah. Uh, for ten dollars, thank you. God bless y'all, uh, you and flawed. As a white conservative, I respect you, bro. Fuck the haters. Build the wall. Deport them all. Uh, I think. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> that was. Where did that? That was a roller coaster. Wait, wait. That was a roller coaster. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna read that again. 
<laughs> I did not get blessed in that. Uh, who cares? God bless you all. As <laughs> all of us got blessed. Flawed, though. And flawed as a white conservative, I respect you, bro. I mean, wait a minute. Why? Why wouldn't other white conservatives? Are you saying like, you're racist? <laughs> that's you not. Re- that's me. not a surprise. I feel like most hey, white conservatives I know I aren't it. racist. I appreciate. Yeah, you don't it. have if to have the racist, you respect me. Maybe I he was saying. It. Maybe he was saying that flawed is a white supreme or not a supremacist white. <laughs> oh, he's like oh, as, oh, as oh, a oh, white oh, conservative, oh, flawed. Oh, you, oh, I respect wait, you because you're white. Right, because he didn't vote for Biden, so he's white now. Right, yeah, yeah. Uh, and I am a supremacist, yeah. so that's yeah. right. All right, all right. He's got all the right. white hood right now. So yeah, so <laughs> fuck the haters, build the wall, deport them all. I like it. I like it. I agree. Uh, Metasep says it should be mentioned who Hassan's audience is when it comes to soul sucking. Think about putting up with that in suffer a lot. He's that's not wrong. That's a good point. He's There's a lot of low cow uh, yeah, audience. You know, they're, yeah, they're watching for the funds. It's true. Yeah, yeah. I didn't think mm. about that. Uh, my audience is awesome, so I True. don't have to deal with that kind of shit. Uh, Mark Shaw stuff donut. says two kids, in case you're confused. Um, oh, I, I'm glad you said that. Uh, said so, because he, I missed one of your chats. Uh, he said, "Good luck mm. and Godspeed. You'll love it. I have two. Oh, you have two nice. kids. All right, nice, nice, nice. That's great. That's my end game goal for now. But you're gonna have ten. We'll, okay, we'll, we'll see." <laughs> No, don't. I, hey. I can't say. I mean, look at my my grandparents had hey. a shit ton of kids. So, I mean, my dad had five. My That's sister has five. My other sister has three. And so they, yeah, you're dude, going the Krigler, past you, buddy. The Krigler genes are strong. Right, when it comes to <laughs> uh, love lover of green for ten dollars says, did you guys cover the Taylor Lorenz lives of TikTok interview? Lorenz is the ep- epitome of everything wrong with U.S. journalism. She refuses to let her face napkin go and hold zero accountability. Uh, we didn't talk about it. I saw. Did you guys see this? The, I saw the, some of the like, photos. I, I didn't see clips. the actual. <clears throat> why? Wh- what I want to know is why the fuck would t- would Taylor and Lives of TikTok get together? I That's what like I was they, wondering. They hated each other, and you they Lives of TikTok just were passive aggressive and mean to each other the entire time. I, I know, and I'm like, why would either <laughs> like, of them agree to that? It was some girl shit in reality. Yeah. <laughs> it really was. It looks like Superman like, and Bizarro <laughs> Superman like fighting yeah. each other. <laughs> you know? They have like the same hair. So funny. I didn't even think <laughs> about that. That's that's hilarious. Hilarious. I don't mean to put that uh, that shade on you. She's no, great. But She's great. But it is yeah. what it is. But they just, great. You guys kind of look the funny. same. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. uh, that's funny. Bacon stuff donut again says, fuck Joe Biden. I'm voting for Trump. Based. I, agree. I like it. Yeah, facts. I like it. Everyone should have that same energy and for for another 10 too. So thank you for that. All right, let's talk about this. Um so this a guy burnt himself? Yeah, crazy. He lit, him, lit himself yeah. on fire. Did you guys see for this? Palestine. Is that what airman turned fireman means? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> <That's Yes>. crazy. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, so I the title was what you were talking about. That's crazy. Yeah, airman oh. turned fireman. Um, <laughs> Aim. I mean, that's in the most literal fuck. sense, uh, that's oh, what happened. Uh, so did. let me let me pull up this article. I have. That video was fucking crazy. So wait, he did like what that monk did, where he lights himself yes. on fire in protest. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It, yes. Oh yeah. 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 yeah he died. <laughs> I mean, um, I assume, right. <laughs> yeah. 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 Wow. All right. So Andy you know has uh Did he film it? Oh, oh. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. There's a video. He talked I'm not it up play. the whole way. He was what like, I'm doing this. So he so uh, he, like he snuff yeah. filmed himself on the internet over Palestine. Yes. I don't, yes. I, don't, I don't think somebody is in the right mental state. Or fine, bro. Not, you know? It's disturbing. Yeah, clearly not. Wow. Probably. Yeah. So the US <laughs> Air Force member who set himself on fire outside the Israeli embassy in DC in an act of protest has been claimed as a member of the far left. Aaron Bushnell of San Antonio died from his injuries in December. Another pro-Palestinian protester set him or him uh, herself on fire outside the Israeli consulate in Atlanta. Pro-Palestinian propaganda has been extremely effective in the West in radicalizing leftists into carrying out violence on themselves or others, which is just absolutely wild to think about. I mean, um, they're all transitioning. It's very sad. It, it really is. You know, like you, you hate to see uh, mentally ill people uh, harm themselves. I don't. I, I, I hate to see it. Keep it off camera. You're right. 
I yeah, hate this. Yeah, yeah, I didn't. I I didn't see the actual video. I saw a video where then it gets muted or like like blurry. Yeah, that's yeah, what I saw too. But, but you hear him screaming, still screaming, and, free Palestine. But but he he was he, yeah he you could you could hear that he was in pain, yes. screaming it like he was yeah. screaming, but free Palestine. But it's like, guess what? That does absolutely nothing. Yeah, what did it do? Um, yeah. He, it killed. He killed himself. Yeah. That's what did it, it do to the, he, like, the he, situation? He lost though. his Nothing life. Changes. You know, and and people are now post. People on the left are now posting like rest in power. Yeah. Um, rest people have drawn power. pictures. They've made What's graphics name? for it. Um, so, I mean, it did. Not, it did something for them. It made them more radicalized. He's a martyr for them. Yeah. Uh, and, it's still and, sad and because the left, he's look. The left misled. still hates him though. Look, oh yeah, can absolutely. we not can, can we not use this phrase on white men, please? Oh, I get goodness. the sentiment, but rest in power is historically used to mourn black people who were killed by hate crimes and police. Twenty six like, K likes. Look and look, <sighs> Veronica looks like a white liberal. I I she I think <laughs> I can't tell. Oh yeah, there she is right it's there. Like, look on the right. Twenty six K likes was for the uh, look at it. it is. Please. Look at this. Oh, it's for the original tweet. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's that's right. uh, white white man, man literally burns himself alive for Palestine. Left to still hate him for being white. Now, yeah. I I'm bringing this up for a reason because I felt really guilty laughing at this. All right, <sighs> the now it's quote true. tweeted. This was quote tweeted by Razor Fist. Yep, and he said, well, "He's black now." <laughs> Damn, <laughs> like, bro. That's rough, bro. Damn, bro. Crispy. No, I I felt I felt wrong. Laughing at that. It's funny though. I mean, it's kind it of funny. funny. It it's funny. But, I, but, but I'm, not, I'm not happy to do that. Hold on, not, hold on. But it's funny. I re I replied. I said the layers of this burn are incredible. This is <laughs> fucking crazy. <Yeah. laughs> what are we doing today? This, Dude, burn, I, I, literally burned himself. <laughs> the layers I'm sorry. of this burn is crazy. I'm sorry. I I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. I alien I, turned fireman is crazy. He's black now. I saw, is crazy. I don't know why I don't watch Crowder, um, but I saw a clip why? of him talking. Uh, on, <laughs> why, it's so why, entertaining. Why, You're missing. Why, like, why, 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 why don't I watch him? <laughs> why, why don't I watch him? No, I saw a clip and he said, I don't feel bad. But I do, I do feel bad that people were like convinced to go this far. Yeah. And I was like, all right, because I like I didn't feel bad at all, and I was like, "Bro, the I, cop ran up and said, get down, get down.' He, get he did. Down. The cop, a cop pulled a fucking gun alive. on the dude, and he's, he's oh, laying he on, on the floor screaming yeah, while he was on Drop fire. And it was oh, like, and then and then a, someone else came with a fr fire extinguisher, yeah. and the, the other guy's like holding his gun to him. And it's like, <laughs> what is he gonna do? What are you afraid of? <laughs> Don't run at God. me, please." I absolutely Easy. do feel bad. I, I feel, I feel really sad. Too. It's very, very sad too. that somebody would get deluded to that level where they would burn themselves for a cause that does not care about him. Yep. I feel yeah. bad for, for suicide bombers. Like you that person has been so fucked up and does not have a moral guidance that could lead them in the right direction. They get led way down and yep. they fucking kill people. I feel bad for serial yeah. killers because they, they have gotten fucked up at some point and got to the point. I don't condone the actions, obviously. I don't think that they were right in what they did or any of that, but I'm still sad that somebody it's was corrupted at that point. Yep. It's a mental effect. You pity them, which is understandable. because it's, it's tragic. Yeah. It's very sad. Well, yeah. I do champion the things that serial killers do. Like what? Kill let, him cook. let him cook. <laughs> let him cook. Hold up. Continue. Let him cook is crazy when we're talking about this. Don't do that, guys. <laughs> that pretty... Don't do that. <laughs> well, the cop let him cook pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> the cop He's like, I'm not gonna get involved, cook, but man. you know, you know what to do. Don't Bro. just don't come at me. That's I think that's what he was. He was like, yeah. If this guy runs towards yeah. me, I'm shooting I'm his ass. Him down. Yeah, I'm putting my question is where was Smokey the Bear? You know, True. where were you at, dog? True. Only you can. Oh, you set your. Oh, you. Oh, well, this is uh, true. This is awkward. Well, this my is God. True. Yeah. Wow. Uh, <laughs> anyway, that was wild. I just I wanted to see what you guys had man. to say about that. Man. Um, don't yeah, don't fire, fire, guys, and don't kill yourselves. It's not a good. Yeah, idea. don't do it. Facts. It's not good. Facts. Yeah. yeah. Facts. V16 says just. 
just remember the Democrats are a cult, a religion of delusion, just like any religion. They have their zealots. This is true. Well yeah. yeah, this yeah. is true. Yeah, exactly. Even though they try to ignore it and act like it's the right is so crazy. They have all these weird people who are going to do things to people. And it's always the left. That's what it seems like. To me. All right. Diana Francisco is saying I misread her rant. It better have my name in it, Diana. I mean, going to say that right now. She did. <laughs> what if it says she did? Fuck flawed. Yeah. Oh, it's just in your brain. You cut it wow. out. Wow. Krigler said fuck flawed. And she came back and said I, fuck flawed. I, you forgot I, the I, fuck flawed at the end. I that ignored it completely. I like, I <laughs> wow. No, look, li listen to the original rant. Ready? Okay. <laughs> I, I'm such an asshole. Wow. <laughs> He's over here propagandizing <laughs> Diana's messages. That's crazy. It's pretty gaslighting listen. us. <laughs> it's so bad. Listen to this. Call. So good to see you again. Hugs to. To you and Tigra, I I stopped right there. And I was like, oh, oh, you know why? Because Call sat down, and he was like, oh, oh hey, yeah, 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 yeah. So I I got distracted, and I was like, did you hear that? I wanted to make sure he heard it. But then and you then just I, took me completely out. You didn't have to just like <laughs> you, were then, gone at the time. you were gone at the time. You she left. didn't say well, anything. About no, no. You. Hold on. Let me explain. She then she rumble ranted right after that about Garrett. To see, good to see him too. So I, and I saw that. So I didn't read the rest of the original one that said flawed love to you and Mo. Nice. Yeah. So what if it was just flawed love to Mo, but not you? <laughs> flawed, let Mo lot and let Mo let know. Mo love know as well. Yeah. And Gary. <laughs> I'd and like Gary. her to know. <laughs> but you don't accept any of that love. <laughs> oh man. But now I feel bad. Diana, I'm sorry. Uh she said, Adam, you misread my rant. Because I did say how much I love Flawed and Mo. I love you too, Diana. Actually follow me on X. Uh, LOL. So does George and Andreas. So love to them as well. Garrett, uh, uh, I didn't hear Garrett's name in that one. <laughs> I don't follow nobody Garrett. anymore. Sorry. She, she got, she got, he got his own rant. Just, just him. I don't, I don't you guys, you guys got to split together. All right. Yeah. Well, all right. Garrett, Garrett, Garrett right. got his like his own full rant. You know, that's all right. And then, Garrett's special. Of course, I, I did also. Mm -hmm. So just Garrett's saying. special. Um, V60. No, yeah. Oh, from... I read that one. Yeah, yeah. You heard uh, sure. Oh, yeah. He said Mary, <laughs> Mary Poppins movie UK age rating raised almost sixty years after its release because of discriminatory, uh, discriminatory, language. discriminatory, discriminatory language. Um, for two, what, that. The fucking uh, Chitty, Chitty Chitty bang bang. Chimney, the chimney boys. Yeah, I I don't give a shit. Um, hey, what did they say? I, I'm gonna. My kids are gonna watch that movie, right? I mean, He's dope. You, what, what I that? don't know. What is even said in know. that movie? I can't even think. Like when? Like who? Who? Like what? Mary Poppins is popping off with some very inappropriate <laughs> language. I I'm Mary Poppins, y'all, dude. That, <laughs> Fuck y'all, niggas. Marvel has that. been trash, but <laughs> but that single line made me laugh so much. Gar Guardians of the Galaxy. Guardians two, of the Galaxy is pretty good. The dude's floating down. He's like, "You look like Mary Poppins." Was was she, was he cool? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I'm Mary cool. Poppins, y'all. It's like, dude, that shit I don't made even me know laugh. What that was. So, so it was a great moment a too scene. in the movie. It was a great it was movie. A good, it was, a, like it was, yeah, I liked it. it I don't remember zombie zombie that happened. Happened. Yeah. yeah, I like the Guardians of, Guardians of the Galaxy movies. I think yeah, they they're were pretty good. solid. I like them. I don't remember anything um, that happened. Lord of the Rings says he was auditioning for the role of the Human Torch in the coming Fantastic Four. Oh my goodness. Y'all are mm. bugging. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> on. I, I actually forgot what we were talking about, but <laughs> I I I heard Flod's reaction and then I was like, oh <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're talking about now. Wow. Oh, Mark Shaw yeah. says clown planet. I mean, dude. This is there's true. countless yeah. things that we can we're bring really up to weird place to fit this in there. True. This is true. Yeah, it's wild. What do you guys got going on, Garrett? What, what about you? What are you? What are you doing? Uh, tonight after the stream at nine, about an hour from now, I'm going to continue my playthrough through Resident Evil oh, One. Resident Evil. Nice, wow. Master. We're making some progress. We've got some new keys. We're, we've got the uh, armor key now, so we're unlocking that part of the house. It's a lot of fun. It's very difficult because the camera is trash, but that's, that's how it was back you. in the day. That's, that's how it was back in the day. It looks like someone just threw a camera, and you're just running through that room. That's just how it I is. Hate it. So we'll I hate it. I won't do it. I can't. I can't do it. Uh, I won't do it. Yeah, but I like awful. everything I else outside of that. Outside yeah. of the camera, it's fucking great game. It's very unplayable. Scary. Yeah, unplayable. 
<laughs> Untrue. I agree. It's unplayable, bro. I, I did it. I bought it for five that minutes. Game? And I was like, Steam, give me my money back right now. That's how it used yeah. to be, though. That's like, it's not like they made it bad. Like it used to be that way. That's how it was on the. No, no, it was no, no. Good back in the day. One game. That one game made me that, not ever, that... ever play Resident Evil ever. Really? Resident Evil Two. They've changed the I camera like Resident completely. Evil 2. Resident Evil. I never played right. any of them. Awesome. Yeah, never this played is my any first of playthrough of all of them. I played like the first quarter or half of resident evil 2 and then i put it down for a while so i'm redoing them we're gonna play through all of them uh mm -hmm. well up to four maybe <laughs> i heard five and six are not good so most maybe playing, we'll stop i heard most seven is seven. awesome yeah i heard seven, seven yeah that's right what i heard now. i heard Which it was like the one through four. I, watched call, I watched call play seven. Oh, seven oh is that the one with the so with the good. it's like texas chainsaw master the, type the lady or no, is that eight that I'm thinking? No, the so, village. so seven is the bayou with like the, the swamp, and then the one after that is like the village where it's like this like werewolf Dracula. But the bayou is like cannibals. Yeah, I've yeah. seen you play yeah, okay, yeah. That's what I'm playing right play those. I might skip five and six because I heard the trash and go straight to seven, eight. Do it that. Yeah, way. So that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Nice. nice. Is, Resident Evil Three was good. Resident Evil Three is amazing. Yeah. Is that the one with Carlos? That's what you're yeah. telling me I need to play yeah, with yeah. Nemesis. It's lit. Oh, okay. It's lit. Yeah. Okay. It's both it's my main character in Dead by Daylight with my main right. killer in Dead by Daylight. So yeah, it's like it's, uh, okay. I mean I feel like I need to play that game because it's, it's like, a good one, bro. I, I main it Nemesis is. and Carlos in Dead by Daylight. So and then you can feel the pressure also of Cenobite. actually being chased by Nemesis, which yeah, is not when he like... breaks through the windows and just like, yo, fuck you, I'm coming to kill you. And that I won't lie, like, it got me triggered. He's a like gangster, I, was, bro. I was losing my shit when I was yeah. streaming that. Nemesis like, is a fuck, fucking gangster. Getting he angry. Is. Awesome. True. What do you got yeah. going on, Call? I'm gonna check out the unknown, the new killer in DVD, stream it, and then I'm taking. Oh my yeah. Cat. Yeah, yeah. Have you seen that? The unknown I've, is the new I, killer. Yeah. They, he's they made creepy it so as shit. He's super creepy, and um, you ha the way to counter him is you have to look at him, which is kind of crazy. Yeah. He's like Dude, the, he's he's gross looking. Like he's good. Disgusting. Like yeah. he's really. Ots was saying he's very up there, like a killer easy. You could teleport oh, really? around yeah, the map. You could freaking. You got a a range attack. It's he he's like. he's freaking bonkers, dude. Dude, I was watching the latest flex cam, flex cam video, and he played as killer. Oh really? Yeah, like he did one game surviving against the ah. horror or the unknown, but then like. Oh, he's played. crazy looking. Yeah, he's fucked up. That's definitely nightmare fuel. It. He's creepy as fuck, bro. I don't even know what he's from. Is he from something? I don't know either. Um, heard of him. Let's see. I'll just go to this fandom site, whatever it works. He's spooky though. Yeah. All right. Oh, there. He's, he's got. Looking. He's got this like tiny head, um, uh, and like weird body. He's, dude. This guy's freaky. He can yeah. teleport around. Yeah. It's he's anyway. For those who play Dead by Daylight, he's, he's a strong killer. Looking. He's he's going to be hard to go up against. He does look like Ricky anyway. Berwick a little bit. Yeah, I don't, I don't know who that is. Am <laughs> you know, you know Ricky? Ricky? Is? Uh, oh, Ricky with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can see it. That's fucked up. Yeah, a it's bit. there. It's there. But you know what? That's his humor. So yeah. I guess yeah. he laughed. I wouldn't have he, said it if he wasn't. You know. Yeah, he's uh, yeah, he's he's an interesting character. <laughs> yeah, he is. Um, cool. Are you streaming that tonight? Yeah. After the show. Cool. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna nice. get food first. Nice, I'm hungry. Nice, nice. I'm hungry myself. Yeah. Well, what are you? Uh, what are you up to, Vlad? Uh, you, nothing on. really. I have nothing. I'm just you know trying to get my wrestling thing going on. That's probably what I'm gonna do after this. Go on, okay. go watch Raw, and uh, then talk about it on Discord, right. and record it for my channel. And uh, okay, yeah. so you're you're not being live. You're gonna do it live in Discord. Record yeah. yourself reacting and like talking about it, and then put it up as a video. Yes. So chop it mm. up. And put okay. it up there edited so it's like because you can't put wrestling content on w on youtube i know it's like a what? separate you're, you'd be like really? fighting each other but you should talk to d day cobra because he's he talking wrestling? about doing stuff like that yeah yeah he's big into wrestling what do you mean we'd be yeah. fighting each other well you know he's got his channel you've got your channel but you could like do a show oh, no, together not, yeah, no. i didn't know he fucked with wrestling like that yeah yeah oh, he's been talking about doing a, another channel even though he has a million of them yeah but doing one that's specifically about uh, i'm wrestling. down I'm down because yeah, yeah, there's not enough people who talk about wrestling that I like know, you know. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. To tap that market. You guys maybe. should. Facts. Yeah, you guys should talk. I love that. I'm all about. Yeah. Nice, uh, nice. Diana Francisco says, "Best ever is the Krigger Chat family. I love you all so much. No Robert, no peace. I know. I don't see Robert around much anymore. 
His uh, name is Robert straight... Paulson. Wiles. His name uh, is Robert Wiles. That's okay. <laughs> yeah, Steel Leg of History. <laughs> well, Steel Leg of History. Um, now, but uh, yeah, he's been streaming a lot. He's I see him every once in a while. Yeah, some boys. Yeah, he's yep. doing his own thing. I try I like to smash it. that like button whenever I see him live. Uh, V6Nan says, Breaking, hazmat unit descends on Donald Trump Jr.'s home after he received death threat. White powder. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Uh, oh, well. If it was cocaine, that's what would be in the news. So <laughs> it, probably, it probably isn't. They'd get rid uh, of it. Yeah. I mean, the, or actually, no, it's it's Trump. So oh, they plant it. For it. Yeah. 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 yeah something yeah. like that. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, everyone, thank you for tuning in. Thanks for all the kind words. Uh, I really appreciate you all. Uh, yeah, I can't wait brother. to show you guys my new setup. I'm really excited about it. It's almost done. Hopefully, the electrician makes it tomorrow. Uh, if he does, my lights will be on and my outlets will be turned on so I can actually create stuff in there. I'm really looking forward to it. So hopefully nice. um, we'll be doing something soon. And if I have a good signal in there, I might just do a live stream in there. Fire. Just kind of like show you guys uh, the spot. And once that happens, I'll show you guys my new channel, which uh, is almost ready. And I... We'll have to like go through the process to get it monetized and uh, start putting out uh, content on it. So thanks, guys. Okay. Oh, yeah. And uh, all right. Well, we'll see you guys next time. Make sure to go follow everyone in the description below. You can find all the links and, and to all their stuff. Uh, also, I have an affiliate le link for Ground News. I love Ground News where I get uh, pretty much all of my different biases uh, cross reference on any story that's out there. I just like click a couple different versions of the article and you could see how. The news skews it in different ways. Uh, if you're interested, check out uh, Ground News. It's really awesome. And if you want to sign up, use my affiliate link. And uh, it helps me out. So definitely check now. that out. Sweet. Uh, oh, okay. We got uh, two more things. Alistair Campbell, celebrating two months, says, Congratulations to you on your baby announcement. Thank you, Alistair. Nice Appreciate two months. That. And uh, uh, Juan Castle for five says, I thought at times starting a wrestling channel myself. But there's like a million channels already specifically from the brits what well, listen, culture that, yeah, what uh, culture that, that that energy is gonna prevent you from doing a yeah, lot of you things. just gotta do it bro because you'll, yeah. you'll set yourself apart by being a different person than them you know True. yeah but, none of those channels have you on it exactly so that's why you need True. to make your own channel exactly that's precisely and they might well, just be like this is way better this energy for some reason i like it more that's how it works man but you got to come with that energy yep True. exactly <laughs> exactly all right, boys. Nice. Cheers, everybody. Have a great night. Peace out. Peace.